Hi, Chan. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Good news. I found Pikmin 4. What? Nah. Stop me if this sounds crazy. You're gonna stop me immediately, because it is crazy. I found my copy of Pikmin 4. It was... In the case for Pikmin 4. Crazy. Uh, that really is kind of nuts. I never put my Switch games in their cases. Um, I always put them... I've got a... Like a... What is it? Like 16 game carrying case. They're either in there, just the cartridges, or they're like lying on my TV stand. I, uh, I always forget to put them away. Unless it's a game that like... I know I'm not coming back to anytime soon. I don't usually put it away, but I put Pikmin 4 away for some reason. But uh, we whipped it back out so that we could finish it up and, the, and then put it away again, I guess. Tonight may well be, and we're gonna try, and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna shoot for the moon. This will hopefully be the final Pikmin 4 stream. On, on Twitch, I think we're going to close this out, and I think, um, I think it's going to cause a chain reaction. It's going to be, uh, you know, finish this one out, and then everyone's game is going to uninstall itself across all the switches. So, that'll be cool. But we've got, um, we've got the final boss fight. Which I'm hoping won't take me too long. I'm not doing an hour-long intro, and I hope that won't take me too long. And then we've got the Olimar... Uh, you know, journal, little game mode, which I was told rough estimate on that three and a half to four hours. Is that true? I don't know. You also have to throw in the Mikey time tax, um, which is an extra 25%. So I don't know, but you know what? If we don't finish it tonight, that's okay. Um, we'll get really damn close. If we don't finish it tonight... I think there'll be one more stream after this. Um, but that that also won't be next week. I'm not playing this next week. I got a whole different lineup for next week. But anyways, that's the plan to uh, close out Pikmin 4. And I, you know what? I'll probably say this again, but I'm going to miss it. I'm going to miss Pikmin 4. Um, this isn't my game of the year, but these have been... Uh, some of the best streams. They, honestly, m not my game of the year, but this might be my my uh, stream game of the year. I, I don't think uh, any other game came close to both being like a nice, like laid back, like let's hang out and talk game and a like, I'm going to go fucking nuts, gorilla hump around my room um, kind of game. I, I think Pikmin 4 has it all. It's got both sides of the coin. So, uh, I'm gonna miss it, man. I really am. But I'm also not gonna miss it too hard. At least not right now, because... Dear God, I've been playing this thing since, since the day it came out. I'm still playing this shit. When did this come out? Has this, this has been at least six months, right? Pikmin... For release. July. Okay. Came out July 21st. So I've been playing this game for five months. Ah. I'm ready to be done. It's a great game. These have been some great streams. I'm a little Pikmin down. I'm ready to be done. And then uh, and when I'm done, I'm done. We can move on to uh, some other stuff. So, here's hoping tonight's the night. I just bit my tongue. Here's hoping tonight's the night. And we close it out hard. We'll see what happens. So the release date is my birthday. I'm giving the best gift a new game in my favorite franchise. See, I wish that worked for me, man. Happy birthday, first of all. But I wish that worked for me. On uh, my birthday, they should give us a new Fortnite. If 
if if Epic Games cares on, on oh, October 8th, 2024, Fortnite 2. Fortnite 2, The Revenge of Jonesy. We just got three new Fortnite. Those are new game modes. Those are new game modes. That's different. That's different. They got a whole new launcher. Make the Epic Game Store 2 exclusive title Fortnite 2 Jonesy's Revenge. Show up separate on the store? What store? The Fortnite store? If I boot up the Epic Game Store, I can't download Rocket Racing, can I? Without Fortnite? You can download Lego Fortnite by itself? Really? I didn't know that. Well, that's a spinoff. That's not a new game, you know. Lego Fortnite's a spinoff of Fortnite. I want Fortnite 2. I want Fortnite 2. Jonesy's Revenge. Day 1 DLC. Uh, Grandpa skin. It's because of ratings. Lego Fortnite is E for everyone. I could, okay, that makes sense. I want a grandpa skin. I want, okay, Fortnite 2. This is my wish list for Fortnite 2. Hold on. Now this is going to be an hour long stream. Or intro. Uh, my, my wish list for Fortnite 2. I want them to collect my data so hard that, um, you get like a skin of grandpa and it's like your own it's the, like they've they've like went to ancestry.com and pulled up your like grandparents information and the skin is your actual grandpa um i want if you um if you get like a win in fortnite 2 i want it to like send a text to your boss be like hey give this guy a raise I want Fortnite 2, if you lose, uh, if you get reported, if you get banned from Fortnite, um, they have, like, the location of your house, so they just drone strike it. Tim Sweeney drone strikes your house. Um, and then you've got to build a new one, like in Fortnite! That's my wish list for Fortnite 2. Now, my wish list for Fortnite 3... Uh, first of all, Fortnite 3, uh, Peely, Unchained, Peely, Peely Origins, there we go. Uh, first thing, no guns. Second thing, no movement. Third thing, no, uh, story. I wanted to just be like, uh, GM Flat. And, uh, all, everyone loads into one lobby together as Peely, and you just stand there and can talk. You have voice chat. You just talk to each other. I think I just invented VR chat. Whatever. Hey, good night, chat. Oh, I should have got a cup of coffee. We'll do that. Um, I'll take a break in a bit, and I'll I'll get a cup of coffee. But, Chan, how are you doing? How's everyone doing? I had I had a way better day at work today than yesterday. No one screamed at me. No boomers shit their little diaper, and that was nice. Um, played some Final Fantasy today, and that was nice. Kinda, I gotta be real with you, like, this is gonna be a good stream, I'm gonna have fun tonight. Can't wait for the stream to be over. <laughs> Whether we finish Pikmin 4 or not, I got Saturday, Sunday, Monday, I'm just, I'm, I'm Jay chilling. I am vibing with the fam. I get, I get to spend a uh, weekend with my, my friends and... 
I'm just excited to be, uh, to have no obligation other than to see my friends. You know, like, it's, um, it's gonna be nice. It's gonna be poggers and epic pilled. But I need to, uh, I need to get through this stream first. And I need a cup of coffee to do that. Holy shit. But he just wants to get rid of us. Yep. Anyways, uh, no, I'm just, uh, you know, I'm excited to see my friends, man. The sooner the stream's over, the sooner I can go to sleep and wake up and see my friends, you know? So, excited about that. I ate, I ate a Five Guys Burger before this stream. That's cool. Exciting shit. I do have uh, something I, I should probably tell you. I, I could probably make a little bit of a... Hey, this is cool. Um, today I got accepted to uh, the onyx.gg, which is a really big GTA 5 RP server that all of my... I watch a lot of GTA RP. I've even streamed some GTA RP years back but um all of the people i watch play on that server all the people that i I've, I've loved for years play on that server and i got accepted to that server today so i would not say like and guys next week we'll be playing uh, uh, uh. there's a lot of things i need to do beforehand because i have an idea of what i want to do and i kind of want to get it to that point before i start streaming it for you but I, uh, I would say at some point, 2024, you're going to see some GTA RP for me. And I'm, I'm very excited about that because I, I love GTA RP. It is, it is like the one thing I, I watch consistently. I, um, I watch it more than I watch shows or movies or YouTube videos or any other kinds of streams. Um, I watch a lot of GTA RP and uh, from some really funny people from some really funny like let's make a funny fucking character and then lose a bunch people and uh, I'm very I feel very strongly that I'm a good fit for that I feel very strongly that that is the kind of stuff I think I do really well at of here's my dumb fucking character. Oh, I'm I'm losing. I'm losing. And as long as it's funny, you know. So uh, I'm very excited. I did not think I'd get accepted. That is a that's a big server. That is a popular ass server. Um. And I applied for it in August, I think. It had been like, oh, I'll check it. You know, like maybe once every two weeks. Checking to see what my application, what status it is. And then today I like went to it and it just had like server queue 250 out of 250. And I was like, well, that's different. Did I click the wrong thing? And so I reloaded the page and it was the same thing again. And I'm like, oh, I got accepted. Holy shit. Cause I really, uh, listen, I, like, I feel like I'm a good fit for, for, doing RP, especially Grand Theft Auto 5 RP, but I uh, I don't think I'm in the caliber of a lot of people who play on that server. I think they are very good and I am very, not that I think I'm bad, but I'm very green. I'm very uh, new to it. So I very, I've got a little experience, but not a ton. And so I'm very excited to be able to do that. And Hopefully it'll turn into some good streams in a, in a few months when I uh, unveil my character and, and I start streaming it. Hopefully it'll turn into some good streams. Um, I've, I've got ideas for a couple characters that I think are going to be really funny losers. And that's what I want, baby. That's the that's the milk and honey. Um, I... I started working on a clown um 
She's like a really depressed clown character. Uh, who, like, while I'm walking, I'm just gonna play squeaking noises. Like, it's just... It's such a fun avenue to do bit characters, and... I'm really excited to show you guys some of the shit that, um... I, I don't get to do with this, you know? Like, as much as I love playing... Pikmin or, you know, as much as I love doing variety games and shit doesn't give me the opportunity to play a character and I think that's where I shine and I'm very excited uh, to have to have this opportunity to do that, so yeah, got it, got accepted to onyx.gg today and we'll, uh, we'll see where that goes and uh, like I said, don't expect that don't even expect that in like January uh, I've got some stuff that I want to do some stuff I want to test for. I don't want to do a stream where it's just me secluded from the uh, everyone else playing on the server, trying to learn the keybinds. Right? Like I'm. I want to do that off stream. So it's gonna be a few weeks before you see me on stream doing GTA RP. But that is definitely something that is didn't think was gonna be on the table for 2024, and it absolutely is. So, uh, I'm excited. I'm very excited. I'm, I'm like unbelievably excited about it. I get, yeah, yeah, I get the butterflies in my stomach when I think about it. Yeah, uh, I'm saying 2024 already looking pretty damn epic. What's up, Lucas? So anyways, that's, that's the one piece of, of Mikey news. That's the one piece of funny little guy news I wanted to tell you is, uh, that I also should tell you I'm not streaming New Year's Day. I said I might, but I've decided I'm not going to because I have to do plumbing. I And I have to set up for, um, it's sounding like next week, not only are we going to do another Lethal Company night, which I got to DM some people about, but we're also, it sounds like next week will be, uh, we're going to do a Zelda 2 blind race. Me and Pelamoon. It's sound right now. It's sounding like that's happening. So uh, again, you know, it ain't locked down yet, but it's it's sounding like that's gonna happen. We're working out the details right now, but it's it's sounding pretty pretty possible. So leaked, yeah. <laughs> Technically not announced. It's just on the table. Long weekend, and I got the house to myself, so I'm going to get McDonald's. Oh, what are you getting from McDonald's? I just had five guys. What's the McDonald's order? Hey, chat. How's everyone in chat doing? I didn't ask you what's happening, what's happening. What's happening, what's happening. Um, anyone, anyone got any dope New Year's plans? Quarter pounder with cheese. Good choice. That's my... I don't, I haven't had McDonald's in months. I don't know when the last time I had McDonald's was. Maybe when they did that, that cactus plant flea market. But that's my go-to is, is like a quarter pounder with cheese. I had a Big Mac once and did not enjoy it. See, I, I never had a Big Mac until, until the cactus plant flea market thing. Because my parents are like quarter pounder with cheese is a better bang for your buck. So I would always get that. And then for I wanted the Grimace toy, which is a cool thing to say as a 26 year old adult. Um, and it was, you either get the Big Mac or the Nuggets. And I got a Big Mac and tried it and I liked it, but uh, I'd rather just get a quarter pound of cheese. Work it. Are you Kirby? Are you working New Year's Eve? And New Year's Day, or what's the what's the schedule looking like? All the Big Macs are buy one get one free because they suck ass. I like Big Mac. Big Mac's fine. It's it's like all um, McDonald's food. It's garbage, but you know sometimes it's three a.m. And you're just like, I fucking did it, burger. And it hits just right. 
and then you spend the next six months thinking about that one time that it hit just right and you keep ordering McDonald's and it's miserable every single time but you remember that one time at 3 a.m. where it was good that's McDonald's both I'm pretty sure that sucks wait you guys are open on fucking New Year's Day that's bullshit Um, quit. Just quit your job. Most retail places are open New Year's Day. Who the fuck is going to these places on New Year's Day? I gotta go. I gotta get a dildo on New Year's Day. First day of the year. Time to start my new resolution. Buying pocket pussies. Who's doing this? One, one pocket pussy per day. Happy New Year. I just want to say, wow, they're making you guys work today. Yes, because yeah, yeah, I don't. Who is doing this? Who is going into these places on New Year's? I mean, I guess I get like, never mind. I get money. Never mind, I get it. You know who's going in New Year's Day, New Year's Eve? It's people who didn't prepare beforehand. It's people who are going in New Year's Eve like, I gotta get out, I forgot to get alcohol, I gotta get more alcohol. That's who's going in New Year's Eve. Is and and I'm I'm sure uh, I'm sure CEOs making a a pretty penny. That sucks, man. I'm sorry you gotta work that. Just drink and then get the Mac. <laughs> just fucking, yeah, just get drunk before you go into these places. Get drunk. Then go into Walmart. I, dude, I couldn't do that. I mean, I don't drink that much, but like, I don't think I could be any kind of intoxicated and go into Walmart. I would be, I would be like, the fuck, what the fuck, what the fuck did this Funko Pop just say to me? Okay, let's hear you fucking, you fucking Funko Pop, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick your fucking ass. And then I'd fall into like the $5 DVD bin and suffocate on copies of Open Season 2. Need a new calendar and we'll get it on the first day. You can They sell 2024 calendars. I think on January 1st, 2023. You got a whole year to get a 2024 calendar. <laughs> my grandma on Christmas, my grandma was like, Hey, do you need a calendar? And I was like, No, I use my phone calendar. She's like, Okay, I've got 13. <laughs> you got what? She, cause she's an old, she's 90 years old. She's, you know, an elderly woman. And all of these like places that try and get money from her, send her calendars and are like, oh, this is the veterans fund. This is the veterans fund calendar. Oh, this is the um, chain, uh, church of uh, St. Luke Hart. Um, uh, we're, we're wondering if you'd like to make a donation. Here's a lovely calendar. So she has, she had like 13 calendars that she was just giving away for Christmas. So if you wanted a calendar, you should have let me know. I could have got you one. Sorry. CEO is actually not a bad dude. We're open based on mall hours either way. Um, just quit. Just quit. What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Homeless? Uh, just get a home, five head. Hello? Uh, homeless? There are a lot of houses out there. Go find one. 
I'll quit and move in with you. Uh... Uh, you could uh you could sleep on the uh the tub you could sleep in the tub can, um oh we got an outdoor closet do you sleep standing up we've got an outdoor closet build a bunk bed I lived that life for too many years I can't go back to bunk bed life also I don't think a bunk bed would fit in here I think the ceiling's too low. I've I've lived the life of a bunk bed. Uh, er, no, wait. <laughs> In a previous life, I was a bunk bed. <laughs> I, uh, until I, geez, I don't know how old I was. Maybe 15, 14, 13, somewhere in that span. I was, I live, I slept on the top bunk and my brother was on the bottom bunk. And that sucked. That was miserable. I would like to not go back to that. If I could, if I can, I don't want to live that life again. We had to, uh, I had to put uh, railings on the top bunk. Because uh, I was too afraid that I would, even at like, yeah, like 14, I was like, I'm going to roll over in my sleep. And roll out of that fucking bed and die. I'll do top bunk. <sighs> then I got to do bottom bunk. And then if you're in the top bunk and you're farting your ass. I don't want that. Farting. Farting your ass right in my face. I don't want that. Tell you what, we'll build the bunk bed. I'll take bottom bunk and you can sleep under the bottom bunk. Just sleep under my bed. There's room. If you sleep standing up, we've got an outdoor closet. I, that was, you know, that was the one thing. My old apartment, that was the one thing that was better than my current apartment. Is we had this big ass closet that was under the neighbor's stairs, and so uh, my friend Jesse would come stay with us every like winter break, every time he was off from college, and we would just put a cot under those stairs, and he would just sleep there. It was, it was like an extra bedroom. It ruled. Don't think anyone else will fit down here with me. You're under my bed? You guys ever hang your ass outside the un, uh, outside of the covers over the edge of the bed? Looking like a monster just comes up and just Fucking. Would you guys like your ass eaten by a monster? What monster? <laughs> I'm saying, uh, what's who's like a cool monster? Um, Venom? Is Venom a monster? I guess he is, isn't he? That tongue. Mike was out. I don't want him eating my ass. I don't want him eating my... His whole, uh... His fucking tongue's gonna get stuck in my ass, and then we're gonna do a whole slapstick bit and tumble over each other. I don't want to do that. If I had to get my ass eaten by one monster, I'd make it Frankenstein. Why? Why not? <laughs> I 
if, if, first of all, we call him Fuckenstein. Second of all, I would teach him, you know, you know, he like, you know, he's like, uh, uh. I would, I would teach him his first word, ass. So he'd go around, ass, ass, kicking down doors. Let's keep him away from fire. I don't have any fire around here anyways. But he drinks coffee. He smokes cigarettes. He eats ass. He's everything I want in a man. <laughs> That being said, I don't think Frankenstein is like a hide under the bed kind of monster. Uh, yeah, he's more of a kick your door down and eat your ass kind of monster. He's not a he's not a crawl out from under your bed and eat your ass kind of monster. Anyways, a lot of a lot to think about there. I'm personally, I'm more attracted to aliens than monsters. Monsters are like scary, right? But aliens, you know, uh, who knows, you know? Can I press one if you're attracted to the xenomorph? Where's, how do I, how do I type in my own chant? I have to get the blue alien clip out. Listen, you don't even need to get the clip out. I'll, I'll say it again. A beautiful blue alien, babe. What more could you ask for? And I, I hear, you know, a lot of people talking about, oh, Avatar. Oh, he likes Avatar. Avatar? Yeah. Ava, uh, I Avatar time. No. I a I have a par I a I have a target on some blue alien pussy. You know what I mean? <laughs> That, that might be the longest stretch I've ever made. <laughs> Anyways, my point is, um, it's not about the Navi. The beautiful blue alien babes could be Navi, for sure. But also, it could be Crystal from Scooby-Doo and the Alien Invaders. But, you know, all these people out there, oh, the Hex Girls, oh, I know why I like Goth Girls, because I watch Scooby-Doo. Alien girls. Next question. Scooby Doo and the Alien Invaders. Next question. Oh, the Hex Girls made me like Goth Girls. Crystal. Scooby Doo and the Alien Invaders. Next question. <laughs> hey, we gotta, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> I'm not even gonna like try and blame chat for this one. This one really was all me. <laughs> Were your Scooby Doo Crystal War? Oh, I remember. Oh, I remember. Don't ask questions about Scooby Doo furry likers. Uh. I wasn't going to, but sorry that we touched on a raw nerve there. Um, all right, chat, we're going to play Pikmin 4. Before we do, you guys want me to do this at the start of the stream or the end of the stream? Of um, this, this is the last stream of the year, if you, for some reason you didn't know. The year is ending, guys. Don't panic. But, um... Do you guys want me to talk about my favorites of the year at the start of the stream or the end of the stream? Favorites of the year. We're going to look at some old clips from this year. 
Do you want me to do that now, or do you want me to save that for the end of the stream? Uh, so you're panicking. I told you not to do that. Maybe end. It may help fix your brain after Pikmin. Okay. Okay, sounds good. I can do that. Um, let's do this this way. Can I do it this way? Give me one second. I need to check something. I gotta, I gotta find. Should be this, right? January 4th. Okay. Okay. I know where the clips start for this year. I just needed to check to see if I could do that. Man, raw danger was this year. Th no. Was it? I think I did Raw Danger this year. That's crazy. That feels like 2022. That's nuts. That's crazy. That was, those were some good streams. I'm still working on a video for that. All right, chat. Well, then I'm going to hop into Pikmin. We're going to beat Pikmin 4, the boss. Final boss of Pikmin 4. And then we'll um, we'll do this. There's this Olimar side mode. That's kind of like a weird remake of Pikmin 1. Chad, do you think I could do that all in one stream? That Olimar side mode. How, how long is that? I was told it's like three and a half hours. I think you can. Okay. Someone told me it's like three and a half to four hours. I don't remember it taking me that long. Well, I am a Dandori master. Uh, they call me the dirty Dandori dog because I'm just out there uh, ripping it up, tearing up the yard. But it's also me we're talking about. Ahaha. Ahaha. <laughs> Amnesia. Is there, is there anything in your life that the thought of being able to relive it for the first time makes you want to give yourself amnesia? Is there anything where you're like, damn, I wish I could get amnesia and redo that? Um, for me, it's... No. Oh. Well, the music is making me want to say... Playing Donkey Kong Country 2, because that was a great time. I'd love to get amnesia and re-experience my first love. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'd love to get amnesia and re-experience the Rugrats movie. I had some people tell me, and, and this will tie in with what I'm, when I talk about my favorite movie, um, people are saying that Barbie is not as good on multiple rewatches. People are saying that that movie is really, is a really good one run. Now, I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't rewatched it yet. But if that is true, that would be something where like, I wish I could have amnesia, have amnesia and re-experience that movie. Because I had a fucking blast with it. Did I win like five times for it? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Like I said, I, I've had some people say that. I've also, I mean, but I've also had some of the, some people I've talked to who are like, yeah, Barbie fucking sucked. 
Um, Reddit movie? I thought it was funny. I thought it was fun. What's your movie of the year? Well, you gotta you gotta stay to the end of the stream to find out. Cause I'm gonna talk about that at the end of the stream. It's Bible Man New Genesis. Thank you. That's my movie of the year. Game of the year is is Bible Man. Book of the year, it's the Bible. TV show of the year, Veggie Tales. And uh song of the year. Uh, our God is an awesome God, we pray in heaven and in, in, in I don't know the rest of the words, but last term of the year is also the day Bobby Kotick resigns. You got me. I'm running Blizzard now, guys. Woo! Six more World of Warcraft expansions. Woo! We're going to make the game worse with everyone. Uh, StarCraft, more like pfft, craft. We're deleting those games off of every storefront and we're getting pfft, rid of the source code. It's Lost Vikings time. I'm going to do what Blizzard should have done from the start. We're going to be getting rid of all the other Blizzard games and we're only going to be doing the Lost Vikings from here on out. Lost Vikings 3, Lost Vikings 4, Lost Vikings Cart, Lost Vikings MMO, World of Lost Vikings. Lost Vikings Ero Eroji game. Lost Vikings visual novel. Lost Vikings Funko Pops. Lost Vikings credit cards. Lost Vikings gotcha game. Lost Vikings loot box. Finally, Lost Vikings is going to be coming to every thing possible it'll be on your fridge it'll be on your phone it'll be on your nintendo switch and for all you lost viking heads out there don't worry we've got you with the hookup rock and racing will be blizzard's number one franchise going into 2025 we're gonna be bringing back Def leopard we're gonna be bringing back motley crew and putting them all in the classic super nintendo video game I, uh, is, oh, but if I was in charge of Activision Blizzard, I would, um, actually shut down Blizzard. Thank you. I would, uh, I would make everyone just focus on Activision properties. By Activision properties, I mean Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. Thank you. I would say, uh, more Tony Hawk. No, no, nobody would get laid off. In fact, everyone would get raises. Uh... But we're we're just gonna make Tony Hawk games from now on. Thank you. No, none of this Call of Duty bullshit. We're gonna make Tony Hawk. We're gonna make Spyro and Crash. What's another great in Activision? Uh, Guitar Hero and Tony Hawk. Thank you. The Kiro? No, I said I said great Activision. Sorry. Uh, Activision franchises. What's some good... Activision... Franchises. Uh, Candy Crush. That's gone. Cabela's. That's gone. Call of Duty gone. Diablo gone. Gabriel Knight. We're gonna bring back Gabriel Knight. We're gonna bring back Good Geometry Wars. We're gonna bring back Guitar Hero. We're going to bring back Hexen. We're going to bring back King's Quest. Overwatch gone. We're going to bring back Pitfall. Oh, dude, we're going to bring back all those Atari 2600 games. That's where the bread and butter is. We're going to bring back Yar's Revenge. 
Uh, we're gonna bring back uh, Spyro, Tony Honk, Zork, Zork's back. Return to the Return of Zork. Uh, Bubble Witch Saga is back. I know you guys were waiting for that one. Uh, City Building is back. Uh, Diablo Gone. Crash Bank. Um, let's see. Laura Bow Mysteries Bank. Ski Resort Tycoon. That'll be our number one earner. Uh, list of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle games. Activision Ninja Turtle games? Wait, wait, wait. Activision Ninja Turtle games. What? Huh? Konami did the games up until 2007. But then Ubisoft did them. When did Activision release Ninja Turtle games? Was this another country? Oh, Mutants in Manhattan. Yeah. You're you're 100% right about that one. Fake fan. All right. Uh they also did Out of the Shadows. That game fucking sucks. Uh that'll be back. We're going to we're going to get get rid of uh uh World of Warcraft. And bring back Ninja Turtles out of the shadows. Um, yeah, I guess Activision did the like 2012 era of Turtles games. I didn't know that. I did not play any of those because I, I, why would I? They were garbage. And then yeah, Mutant City Manhattan was the last one, which that game was good. I, I had a lot of fun streaming that game. Anyways, the Michael Bay era, yes. The the Nickelodeon, first Nickelodeon cartoon in the Michael Bay movies. Which was an era, that's when I kind of checked out of the whole franchise. So, even though I think the 2012 show is good, I did watch that later. But anyways, we're going to be bringing back um, Mutants in Manhattan. I think now's the time. We're going to get those servers up and uh, get to work on a sequel, I think. Check it in. Uh, yep, we're working on that. And just got word, guys. As the new president of Blizzard and Activision, every fridge will be filled with breast milk. Thank you. Woo! Woo! Drink to your heart's content. Play Pikmin 4. Or GI showing some shitty TMT game around that time. Uh probably out of the shadows. Yeah, out of the shadows was for um Xbox's uh Summer of Arcade. Was it 20 2013? Somewhere around that. It was Summer of Arcade. And, um, that was like, look, we got the Ninja Turtles. And it's, dude, it's fucking miserable. That game is bad. That game's really, really bad. And now it's unlisted and there's no way to play it. I don't even know if there's emulation of that game out there. Which is a shame because that'd make for some awfully good Turtle Tuesday content. But, I don't know. Let me know if there's a way for me to play that. Because I, I would absolutely fucking love... To play that shit show. That thing is horrible. Really bad. I I would love to get the story on that game. Let's play Pikmin 4. Let's finish Pikmin 4.
do this. There we go. <clears throat> Subtitles were colored red, blue, yellow, and purple. Nice. That's smart. The, all I know about that game is it's very ugly. The designs are very ugly. There was, uh, it was really glitchy. It was really uh, unfun. And then when you beat the game, it ends like anticlimactically. And then uh, cuts, hard cuts to the credits and turtle power from the first movie, the first live action Ninja Turtle movie plays over the credits. And it's like, what the fuck is this doing here? Why is this here? It's it's really bad. It's spectacularly bad. And I remember like that thing got pulled quick. The thing was around for like maybe a year or two and got pulled. Same with Turtles in Time reshelled. That was around for like a year or two and then it got pulled. Why do all the bad Turtles games, not all of them, but a lot of bad Turtles games just get pulled? Did you play Transformers Devastation? Yeah, I like that thing. That was fun. I like. I always. I, you know, everyone. Oh, plays Optimus. Plays Bumblebee. Dude, I'm a Grimlock man. Gotta go, Grimlock. Grimlock's probably my favorite Transformer. Because he's a dinosaur. I like the Dinobots. I think they're really stupid in a, in a very great way. Soundwave? Soundwave's great. I mean, you can't... The, the, the trifecta of Megatron, Starscream, and Soundwave is great. That Ochi's ass farting? Okay. Sorry, I'm getting my shmoney up. Alright, so we've got the final boss fight, which I need to finish. Um, because I kind of accidentally made it too hard for myself, because I didn't know. Then, once we finish that, then we'll be able to go over here and do the Olimar shipwreck tail side stuff. And then we're done. And then we're done. Ninety nine percent. Oh, man, there's something else after that, is there? I thought that was it. I'm not going for like perfect score in all of the 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 Dandoris. Pikmin Forever, it sure feels like it. Listen, good game. Great game. I've been playing this game for five months straight. I I Please. God help me. No more Pikmin. Oh, yeah. I didn't get that cup of coffee. I said I was going to. Whoopsie.
Kind of like Dragon Quest XI, where you need to be a little insane to do the post game. Listen, I was a little insane. We've been doing the post game for a pretty long time. It's starting to turn into the game. Okay. So we need like all the Pikmins. So we're going to just do this. And then we're going to stage 19 and I'm going to turn them into the, the Pikmins that I need. It'll be fine. Watch this. You're about to shit your ass at a Dandori kick. All right. See, we got bulbs. Okay. So, let's get some red Pikmin. Let's get some yellow Pikmin. We don't need blue. Let's get some more white Pikmin. And some ice Pikmin. Okay. I have every type of Pikmin. Am I properly prepared for this dungeon? Or should I have just brought more Pikmin from the start? Have I already fucked up? <laughs> Reset run. Alright, we're gonna delete my save. Guys, we're gonna start over from 0% on Pikmin 4. Full 100% playthrough again. Okay. All the Pikmin of the world are my children. Guys, we're going to reset 2023. Yeah, we're going to start 2023 over again. Just so I can play pick Dude, hey, good answer to the amnesia question from earlier. Pizza Tower. I would get amnesia to experience Pizza Tower for the first time all over again. I'd get Amnesia to experience Sonic Adventure 2 for the first time all over again. But also the first time I experienced Sonic Adventure 2, I hated it. And it wasn't until I replayed that thing that I enjoyed it. So maybe that isn't a good answer. Let's kill this fucking dog. Okay, I don't remember how to do this fight. Uh, I do. Hold on. I do. I do. I do. You, you grab his big ass tail, right? What's this dog's name? Uh oh. I'm gonna call the dog Stinky. Scrunchy. Okay. Everyone, kill him. Mods, log on to twitter.com and kill Scrunchy. Oh, 
Alright, hey, so far so good. Not that I remember phase one being that hard. Oh, you tricked me. Now he's dead. Now his skull has been flattened. Uh oh. All right, phase one. Okay, now we got ice phase. Which is basically, you know, just the other phase. It's fine. Flip them and dip them, baby. It's weird that the snowballs, that's not really snow. It looks like hair. Uh-oh, uh-oh, all of my Pikmin dead? All of my Pikmin committed to purgatory? Souls lost to the endless void? Uh-oh. Dodged. Oh, not dodged. Oh, I, I missed. I missed. you hate when you go to the doctor and they say uh yeah can we get a spew sample <laughs> i don't know what the, i don't know what that was i don't know what came over me i'd like to apologize that's what we in the business call a little bit of comedy okay okay now this is where i was shitting the bed before i don't oh wait i can have the will they destroy oh i get it now i get it now Yellow Pikmin, you are my gods. You are the love of my life, Yellow Pikmin. Okay, all right, come here. Oh my god, it's not that hard this time. Oh my god, coming properly prepared it actually works? What the hell? Uh -huh. He's just he's just walking towards me. Menacingly. <laughs> I threw a purple Pikmin in there. That's my bad. <laughs> sorry, sorry, singular purple Pikmin. Uh, shit. Purple? 
Got his ass. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a work. This will work. This is working. God, we're so close. Uh oh, oh, boys, come here. You're going to get eaten. We lost one. Godspeed, brave soldier. <laughs> uh oh, oh, he tricked me. Uh oh, uh oh, I've been fucked. No, guys, no, no, bad. Guys, bad. Get on the dog, bad. I threw a purple Pikmin again. I keep accidentally throwing a purple Pikmin. Uh, I don't think I can get in there. Like at all. I can destroy that orb. And I can do this. I cannot do that. I cannot do that. I cannot do that. Run, boys. Where are my other... Oh, they're there. No, wrong, wrong, whatever. We'll make it work. Everyone on. If you're not on, you're gone. Get on. Okay. All right, another phase down. Fire. Okay. Not good. This fucker keeps going, huh? Oh, is it gonna be the same shit, but with fire? Okay. Hook him. Hook him and snook him. Stressing. Stressing real hard right now, chant. Scrungy has me very stressed out. Whoa, we're okay. Drop your tail. Drop your tail, please. I eat my Pikmin! Yar! <laughs> How many just died? How many just died? Ten? Okay, but we still, we're okay, we're okay. <laughs> Oh, my Pikmin, Mr. Squidward. <laughs> How do I get this fucker's tail? Oh, come on. Ochi, what are you doing, Ochi? Ah, uh, you idiot. Ochi. It's over. He just ate all of my Pikmin. Or not. Or they're okay. Or we're all right. I just... It's really not that hard. I just suck. Okay, those are out. Please give me your tail. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, almost. Almost. Fuck you! Yeah, okay, so you have to destroy those fireballs. You, you don't get an option on that. You have to destroy these. Right? At least I think you do. I don't, I don't see him lowering it. Oh, he lowered his tail. Never mind. Never mind, I got his ass. Oh my god, you idiot! Get on there! Okay, what is this? Green? There's no green Pikmin. Is this poison? He's flying?! <laughs> What the? F uh, excuse me, coming through. Excuse me. Hi. Right, what's the? Uh, what's the gimmick? Mm. Oh, we're okay. Why did I throw blue Pikmin instead of purple? Why did I throw? We got his ass. Okay, all right. This seems not as hard. This seems fine. This doesn't seem pipe specific, which is good. Which guy get close to that whittle tail of his? Cute little tail. Oh my god. I Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Yeah, uh I'm prepared for that now, bud. Sorry. Uh, that doesn't work on me anymore. Fuck you. Uh, okay. Missed whiffed on every single one of those. Okay. Send those pigmen to their immediate death! <laughs> oh no! I didn't know it does that! <laughs> There's the Pikmin immediately die button. <laughs> Please kill him. Please kill him. Please kill him. One more. One more. This better be the final phase or I'm gonna sh I'm gonna piss blood. Fuck you. Dude, that's what it's like when your dog wakes you up at 3 a.m. wanting to go out. Sounds exactly like that. Oh, fuck me! Stop running, boys! That's all right. That's all right. It's okay. Jesus Christ. We missed. We missed. He's gonna scream! Okay. I'm not worried. He's gonna scream. Drop your tail. 
He's dropping his tail. Kill him. Kill him, please. Is it over? Is it over? Ah! Uh... Sorry, Scrungy. It's kind of cute. I love old dogs. I'm a big fan of, of elderly dogs. He's running away. Now fight Louis 1v1. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Louis. Ah. Oh, thank goodness. I think he's okay. Oof. Oh, what a great A troublemaker. I couldn't have said it better myself. What about that giant dog? Oh no, there is more to this game, isn't there? Looks like it got away. I don't know how we're gonna go cure Ochi now. There, that dog's collar. It must have fallen off. It could contain lingering particles or fur from that giant dog. If so, I may just be able to make a medicine after all. Oof. I'll take that tiny glimmer of hope for now. Grab that collar and let's go. Don't forget to secure Louie. I'm not sure my heart can take another high stakes pursuit. We are going to fucking try you for your crimes. You will hang, you son of a bitch. I hate Louie. Number one Louie hater. You heard her. Uh, let's get Louie out of here. The quiet new driver and the embodiment of the word troublemaker. Yeah. <laughs> Or like the embodiment of the word terrorist. Not sure what he's capable of. We may need to tie him up later, uh, just to be safe. Firing squad. Excellent. Now that you've secured the collar and Louie, head on back. Guys, we did it. We're making the Pfizer vaccine. Game over now. Okay, we can get the final Ochi upgrade. 100%. Whoa. -wee. And that's it. Uh, return. And that's Pikmin 4. Surely there's nothing more to do. Surely. <laughs> Congrats, you're 10% done with this game. I'll just turn it off then. <laughs> if that was true, uh, I'm done. <laughs> All castaways have been rescued. Whoa. How can there be more to this game other than the Olimar thing? I've done everything. Welcome home, Ochi. And you too, Mikey. Hi. They did it. A magnificent feat. Um, yes, yes, good work. Uh, now I need to harvest some of the fur, so give me that collar. 
I don't remember what her voice is. The thief drank all my juice. He drank all the lean. <laughs> Everyone takes turn beating the shit out of Louie. I'd be alright with that. You ever play like the old Flash games that were like beat your boss or whatever? Make one like that, but for beating the shit out of Louie. Alright. Give Louie the vaccine. No effect on Moss. Oh no, Moss has to stay here. <gasps> no. This is how it's meant to be, Colin. It's the circle of life, Colin. Ochi must die. <laughs> or Moss. Whatever. Kill both of them. Moss was born and raised on this planet. It would be wrong to change what she is for reasons... Sh Damn, I screwed that up. It would be wrong to change what she is for reasons she can't comprehend. This is her home. Where she belongs. Are you sure? I am. And it's how Moss feels, too. <laughs> Let's go home. The voyage home. Dude, Star Trek 2. Um, I'm, ex I'm, excuse me, I gotta, excuse me, I gotta do the Olimar story, excuse, I mean, I'm not complaining, hey, short stream for me, baby, I'm out of here, I like Pikmin 4. Good game. Hot take? Here's my hottest Pikmin 4 take. Um, uh, more Pikmin. Thank you. Godspeed, Pikmin. <laughs> Goodbye, my little pick friends. Dude, they didn't even really say goodbye, did they? Wow. And the true Pikmin were the friends we made along the way. <gasps> Scrungy! Wowie!
Wouldn't it be cool if Olimar just fell out of the ship? Wait. Hey, that planet kind of looks like Oif. Huh? Question the end question mark. Uh. Oh, I, I guess I really should have done the Olimar thing first. Whoops. Oh. Uh we lost almost a thousand Pikmin. Took me 48 hours to lose nearly a thousand Pikmin. 69 days, dude! That's it? Wait, was the was this all the way Rewatch the cutscenes? No. <laughs> yeah, I'm I, you know me, I always gotta watch the Pikmin 4 cutscenes. I'm watching them over and over again. Alright, let's do um that was Pikmin 4, I guess, but let's do the all of our side mode. Oh I might take a break here for a minute. Go we'll make a cup of coffee. Game's boring. Snooze. Should play something fucking epic like uh uh like uh uh cookies and cream on the PS2. Everyone forget how to prepare for launch? <laughs> oh. Oh? Okay. All right. I get it. First things first. Final Ochi upgrade? Please. Isn't this like an infinite charge? Infinite rush. Fuck yes. Oh shit. Oh, that is nice. That is very nice. Give me money. Pay me. Pay me. Pay me. Okay. We pay me. Collection day, baby. Once a week, I come around, you pay me, or I break some knees. That's how it goes in the pick world. Dude, get me up here. Get me up here. Get me up here. You fucker. Kill him! I'm Louie. I kind of want to stay here. Oh. I'm hungry. I want something fresh. Go find a cave. 
Give me some grub before the onion gets it. Dwarf ball boards. No, I'm not doing fucking Louie missions. Fuck you! You don't deserve food, you fucker. Alright, chat. I'm gonna throw it to a, a pee break. Um, I'm gonna go make a cup of coffee. And then when I come back, we'll do all of our shipwreck tale. So don't go anywhere. Probably probably about five or ten minute pee break. Cloud Watcher, skip ahead five, ten minutes. And then uh we'll do uh all of our shipwreck tale. Louie gives you an item if you well, is it a good item? Is it cool or? It's amazingly terrible. Okay. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see what time it is when I finish Shipwreck Tale. We'll go from there. I'll be right back. Quick pee break and go get a cup of coffee. Be right back. Don't go anywhere. Oh, what the hell? Attention, Twitch chat. Mike is about to go pee. See that right there? I'm keeping it warm for him because in about 10 seconds, he's about to kick this door open and let her rip. While he's doing that, take a moment to subscribe to his channel. Catch up with a friend in the chat, but do not complain about his absence because Mike is taking a pee, which everyone on Twitch needs to do now and then. It's human. It's normal. But what's not normal is a cold toilet seat. I'm heating it up for him. Don't worry about it. I'm getting on it right now. He will be here in two seconds. You can be patient. Show some respect. He'll be back in just a moment. That's right, Twitch chat. You consider this an intermission. Take a moment, grab a snack, but come right back and keep your eyes glued on the screen because he pees fast and he'll pee with great speed and get back to you momentarily. Mike! It's warm! Get in here! I'm telling him to hurry. I'm doing my best. Mike!
Okay. Sorry about that. Sorry if that took longer than a normal pee break. Um, I was messing around with a new coffee maker I got my brother for Christmas. And I, um... I'm kind of becoming more and more of a boomer. 
where um, new tech, I, I'm, it's not even like, oh, I don't understand this. Let me learn. It's, I don't understand this. I'm terrified. I'm mortified. What if I hit this button and it fucking explodes and kills me? Um, but I got a, got the cup of coffee, so. We're good. <laughs> Sorry if that took an extra minute. Do this? Okay. Welcome back. Let's do uh, Olimar Shipwreck Tale. Tell me the tale, Olimar. Okay. Game do I need a gameplay guide for this? That doesn't okay, let's do this. Let's see what this is about. Maybe I'll hate this. What do you mean 15 days left? What do you mean 15 days left? 30 ship parts and 15 days. What do you mean 15 days left? You can't do this to me. This is like Pikmin 1 hard mode. Nice. Sepia town. This is back in 1902. This is Captain Olimar of the SS Dolphin. Currently stranded on an unknown planet, trying to recover the ship parts that were lost during the crash. My spacesuit's life support system will only last about 15 more days. I like that there's like plucky music for this. Yippee! As opposed to Pikmin 1 where it's like, my sh my suit will run out of oxygen in 15 days. I will fucking die. All right. How do we These We're going to do this uh Dandori style. Little classic Dandori coming your way. work oh I gotta okay my upgrades don't carry over I gotta pluck them is this mode like actually hard think you could do it do you want to know uh yes but give me a yes or no answer <laughs> is this mode hard yes or no guys you didn't get your juice okay good you're juiced um let's go this way why did you not get your juice Come on, Brunjerman. Oh, I don't, I can't, I can't pick charge. makes me like the music's so like jaunty that it's kind of like putting panic in me <laughs> you know the rest of this game is like real lax this is like uh i don't know it's like too too uh pip pip music makes me lose control you ever seen the triforce piece dance that Yeah. <laughs> 
You ever, you ever see that? I can't play that on stream. I'll get DMCA'd. There was, so back in the day on the old YouTube, check out YouTube.com. Um, there was this like fake Legend of Zelda cartoon. I don't remember what it was called, but it was, there was a fake Legend of Zelda cartoon and it had like a anthropomorphic Triforce piece with like a funny face and shoes. And it was supposed to be like intentionally bad. But for some reason that became that Triforce piece became a meme because they had him like dancing to that song. <laughs> and that was just big. Real real like classic uh you know, classic internet meme thing of like you're the man now dog style shit. Of just like, this is a funny gif, put it to some music, you know? Uh, I think I know what that one is, but I literally cannot. I don't think I can check it. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get fucking DMCA tactical nuked. I get fucking DMCA'd for, for the Dire Dire Docs music now. Some dickhead on YouTube is like, yeah, I, um, I did Mario Water Music Remix. I own Dire Dire Docs. Thank you. And it pisses me off every single time. I get like genuinely fucking furious when when my whole stream gets claimed because I play dire dire docs. Crazy. Is this gonna give me no, it's just gonna increase my max. Can I take more out? Yes I can. Okay. Best, uh, you're the man that dog. Interior crocodile alligator. I drive a Chevrolet movie theater. That's why the the screening room in the Discord is called Chevrolet movie theater. It's because of that one. Interior crocodile alligator. You know what? I kind of like this mode. I don't I don't know if I'm like sucking shit at it or whatever, but like this is kind of fun because it's like it's like starting a new Pikmin game. I don't have like Ochi Rush to just clear everything. It's fun. Imagine being the guy who ruined the most famous Mario 64 song for everyone. Real. I mean, I straight up... Dude, so I, I was watching a lot of Mario 64 stuff today because I was in a Mario 64 mood. Watching a bunch of, like, programming videos about the game. Um, And I was like, man, I would love to just play Mario 64 on stream. Like, I, I, I don't know when I would do that. Because I know, like, you guys aren't, like... Please, streamer, show us Mario. What the hell's a Mario 64? I don't think it would make for, like, the most amazing content in the world. But um, my point is, I was thinking about that. And I was like, I don't know if I can anymore. Because all of the streams are just going to get fucking copyright claimed. Because one guy is like, yeah, I own the, the music to Mario 64. One guy ruined the whole thing. So, I don't know. I would love to watch someone 64. Would you? Would that be something you guys would be interested in? Just a guy who really loves Mario 64 playing Mario 64. I know, you know, I know some, I can't speed run it. 
Uh, we did do a BLJ on stream. That was cool. But I can't speedrun it. But I do know some cool, uh, some cool tricks, some cool trivia. Uh, I know like some secret, uh, secret grabbable platforms. Dude, I would love. Okay, Crunch, you bring that up. Dad, maybe I do. Maybe I'll do Mario sixty four. Uh, do do with that with that PC like rebuilt source code version, and do it with the Project sixty four, so it all looks like those old renders. I've been wanting to do that for a while. I I might do that. Okay, someone died. Guys, just kill him. Uh, yeah, guys, go build that. All right, we only got one ship part today, but um, if I know my Pikmins, and I feel like I do, that's just kind of how, especially if this is trying to be like Pikmin one. That's just how Pikmin 1 is. Yeah, the start of Pikmin 1 is uh, you make very little progress. And then by the end of Pikmin 1, you're fucking pulling eight pieces a day. Speaking of, let's take a look around. I got guys in that? Yeah, I can. Rockstar can't do anything without getting leaked or hacked. I mean, that's what... When you're the biggest, like, gaming company in the world... That happens. It shouldn't, but it does. That looks way better than Unreal Engine 5 shit. 100%. 100%. I might do that. If you guys would be interested in that, uh, I, I'm gonna put that relatively high on my list because always looking for an excuse to play Mario 64 and if you guys think that that would be fun to watch um, I'm not gonna uh, say no to an excuse to play more Mario 64 I love Mario 64 that's one of my favorite games ever when I when I think a video game that's the f first game I think of is Mario 64 Love that game. I take Mario 64. Good game. Uh, well, you know what? That that's honestly becoming a more and more of a hot take as the years go by. I feel like uh, I feel like a lot of people boot that game up and go, "Oh, uh, camera bad." Like, don't get me wrong. It's not great sometimes. It's bad sometimes. That doesn't make it a bad game. Rainbow Ride makes it a bad game. <laughs> is it Rainbow Cruise? I always fuck up the name. Because one of them... No, it's Rainbow Ride. Rainbow Cruise, I think, is a Smash Brothers stage. Or I have that flipped. Because that's the thing, is I always get those confused. Didn't they just do... Uh, I haven't seen anything about it, but wasn't there a um, source coding, a, a source code unpacking, repacking, whatever, for Ocarina of Time? Didn't that happen a, li a little bit ago? I haven't seen any like crazy mods for that, but I'm also way more into like Mario 64 content creators than I am Ocarina of Time content creators. Because, dude, if they could, they could rebuild Ocarina of Time. Oh. 
do Ocarina of Time, but do the 3DS version of the Water Temple, you'd have a, a you'd have a beautiful game. You'd have the fucking best game. All right, one day. That's all right. I think we did okay. How, uh, pick heads. My pick heads in chat. How? Uh, what would you give me, letter grade wise, for first day? A, A plus. <gasps> the pick music. It's the Pikmin song. Oh, that's nice. That makes my little heart flutter. God, I love Pikmin. <laughs> I know every single Pikmin 4 stream for the last like two months. I've been going like, can't wait to be done with this fucking game. But God, I love Pikmin. God, I love this game. It really, um... I, I said it at the start of this, but, like, I don't think this is my game. Uh, this isn't my game of the year, but this is my stream game of the year. I, I don't think there's a single Pikmin 4 stream I did that I didn't have a good time. I think a lot of you, like, new guys who've been coming around, a lot of the, the new regulars in here, you guys, like, came for Pikmin 4 streams, right? Like, you... you if, if your first one of my streams wasn't Pikmin 4, you sure stayed around because of Pikmin 4. Uh, Pikmin 4 has been, uh, to, to speak uh, candidly, been fucking great for my channel, man. It has been fucking great for my channel. But really, it's been great for my little heart, my little mouth, and my little brain. I feel like the Pikmin 4 streams have been the, the best series of streams I've ever done. I'm going to miss Pikmin 4. I really am. Okay, because we got the other Pikmin games I can do, but... But after Pikmin 4, I am going to take at least a couple months pick break. Before I pick it back up. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Followed before Pikmin 4, first game I caught the stream. Joined both because of Pikmin and Popeye. Okay. So, yeah. You guys, you guys were here. You guys came around for that, for that pick. Never mind. <laughs> Just say that. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Once you do, like, starting a thing and then say never mind twice, I feel like you have to. Oh, Olimar's gonna fucking die. Olimar has fucking died? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So it's gonna be like this. God, chat, I didn't tell you this because I, I had so much, like, anxiety and shit about that asshole that, uh, that came into my job yesterday. But um, when he was, like, yelling at me about how he was going to file a complaint with my boss and uh, I was an asshole and all this stuff. Um, like, I was just laughing at him and telling him to leave. But I was so mad. That I didn't, like, normally laugh at him. I fucking, like, Joker laughed at this guy. This guy was, like, yelling at me, and I went, like, <laughs> Uh, get out of here, guy. And hey, just get out of here. <laughs> I did that, and I keep thinking about that. 
Something about doing that's really like stuck in me of like what where did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> it's just I was I was so fucking mad, and and let, and I'll be honest, I was scared. You know, getting screamed at by a psycho at, at work is not um not a calm experience. But yeah, just fucking went full Joker mode. Had had my own Joker moment, real. But, uh, we're good on that. Talked to my boss, and my boss was like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, you're all good. So unless that guy comes into my job to harass me, no problem. But I am questioning what the, the animal inside did. What the, jo the jorker inside did. <laughs> Who was that man? <laughs> and when I I got when I laughed, he seemed like genuinely like shocked. And I want to say like it was because like I was laughing at him. But there is a part of me that thinks like maybe the Joker laugh worked, dude. Maybe I scared him, <laughs> dude. <laughs> Should have done my Joker voice, dude. Should have gone, shut the fuck up. Scared the piss out of him. <laughs> Sorry, I should have warned you guys. I was going to do my Joker voice. Wanna mess with me? I'm a gamer. Oh dude, that would that's too scary. <laughs> yeah, that's what I, I should have done that. Shit. I should have done that. I should have went, I'm gonna I'm gonna make this pencil disappear. Did I ever tell you? How I got these scars. My daddy was a gamer. I know, like, Heath Ledger Joker performance good. Don't get me wrong. I do think it's good. But goddamn, the, the lip licking thing is so funny to make fun of. It just constantly, like, did I ever tell you I got these scars? <laughs> One night. He's on Call of Duty, and he's raging crazier than usual. <laughs> My mother, she turns to him, and she says, L. <sighs> oh, he didn't like that. Are we at a point where we can make fun of Heath Ledger Joker as a society? Are we allowed to do that? I still think it's a great performance, but am I allowed to make fun of it? Wait. <laughs> I cut my mouth on Gamer Grub from a GameStop. Oh! <laughs> ow, ow, ow. 
I imagined him doing just out of like doing that vo doing the the Joker voice, right? Cut my mouth on Gamer Grub from GameStop, and then just out of nowhere, perfect Tom from Tom and Jerry scream. <laughs> oh! oh, oh! <laughs> I'm tell hey make make me the next Joker, James Gunn, get me in the DCU. Let me be the next Joker. We're gonna be doing uh, Bugs Bunny bits. We're gonna be doing Tom and Jerry screams. We're gonna make the Joker a funny character again. Last couple of Jokers haven't been funny, and that's the problem. Uh, uh, Mark Hamill Joker, that's a funny character. We gotta get the Joker. Jack Nicholson Joker? Funny. Cesar Romero Joker? Funny. We gotta get the Joker funny again. The Joker needs to be going like, Well, Batman? Can I offer you a cigar? And then hand him like a, a lighted stick of dynamite. <laughs> That's the Joker, baby. Oh, I know where we are. He's a joker, so he has to make jokes. That's what I'm saying. He needs to be telling a couple jokes. Batman, uh, Batman's chasing him across an alley, and he goes, uh, You might be a redneck. <laughs> joker should be someone who acts terminally online and thinks they're really funny. Uh... Yeah, but he should also be actually funny. Like, like he should be terminally, terminally. It should be um like ironic funny, I guess. We want a Joker we can laugh with. Yeah, dude. He, Batman's standing there, and all of a sudden you hear the Joker. Uh, knock knock. Ooh. Dude, I'd, I'd piss my little pants. I'd piss and cry. I'd be so fucking scared. The, like, uh... The news is, like, reporting on Batman, and they're saying, like, Ah, uh, masked vigilante! Police Commissioner James Gordon, Jim Gordon, has issued the arrest warrant for the Batman. And the Joker goes, uh, ooh, looks like this is a milkshake duck moment. Shouts out to anyone who knows what the fuck milkshake duck moment means. That's some, uh, that's some, like, 12th level Twitter lore. And just the fact that I say that, uh, proves that I'm, uh, I I'm terminally online. I gotta get off the internet. Good night, analog stream from now on. I'm gonna be recording this shit on VHS, mailing it to you. Oh, you gotta get the honker. You gotta get the honker for the ship. Are you crazy? You gotta get the honker. Dude, I almost got in a car accident today. I forgot to talk about this. I was coming home, going straight through an intersection. Green light. Going straight through an intersection. And a guy takes a left turn. Right? I mean, I'm here. He takes a left turn right here. And so I slam on my brakes and hit the horn and go, fucker. And he goes, he's, he's like yelling at me. And it's like, 
I'm not the one who's taking a left turn into oncoming traffic. Car's bad. Wow, I love that for you. Haha. -ha. Let's go shopping. Haha, -ha, I love that for you. Dude, look at this fucking... Look at Olimar's busted ass ride. No hood. No engine. Oh, there are multiple areas? Okay. Someone stopped before an intersection to let me take a left turn, and I immediately got mad at them for not driving predictably and trying to be nice. Wait, so they didn't go through the intersection. They were going straight, and they stopped to let you make a left turn? Dude, that's, that's fucked up. That's, that's, you're literally breaking driving laws, sir. Um, should I go back here? Chat, thoughts? One or two, which, one, two, which stage should I go to? Open to suggestions. Okay, that's two twos. Stop, stop. To, that's fucked up, dude. I, I don't know. Uh, the worst for me... Um, I mean, I've had a lot of people, I've seen a lot of bad driving. I, I think I'm pretty good as, at a, as a defensive driver, but sometimes it's like, I, you know, you can only, uh, just cause you wear a suit of armor that might protect you from some shit won't protect you from a nuclear bomb, you know? But, um, what's a really bad one? Uh, like, the first week I had my car, I went to go pick up Pelamoon. And someone... I'm sitting at a light. Four-way, you know, it's a, it's a four-way intersection, you know. I'm here. Someone else is here. My light turns green... And they go through the red light. And so we we both started going. And then I hit the brakes. And they hit their brakes. And I just looked at them and went. And they looked at me and went. And then drove through the red light. And they were sitting at the red light. Their light was still red. And they just drove through it. Kill him. That was like a real man in that bug costume we just murdered. Almost everyone is nice here in the Netherlands and is used to it. I can see why you'd be surprised when it's not common. Yeah, I mean, in, uh, in America, everyone drives like an asshole. Well, I mean, the, wor the worst driving I've ever seen, thankfully I wasn't driving, was when I went to, through New Jersey. And it was just nonstop, like, people going like 95 miles an hour in a 25. 
And it was like, what the fuck is happening? That was like, I, I will, if I can help it, I will never go back to New Jersey. Because that was just, it was terrifying, man. Alright, so you guys come here. We're gonna kill this guy and then get get some epic loot. Uh oh. <laughs> Look at that all of our face. Why would they use that face? His eyes popping out of his head? <laughs> the thing I have to remember though with, with like people who drive like assholes or at least the thing I try and remember is like, it's probably not people who live around here. You know, I have, I have the benefit of like, knowing where I am. And when I'm not at a place where I live, like I'm nervous driving. I'm a nervous driver like that. That I don't think I'm a bad driver, but I'm certainly more nervous, which means I, I'd probably be more prone to making mistakes, you know? So, I, I try to keep that in mind, like, when people do, like, insane fuck-ups, where it's like, yeah, but they didn't, um, they didn't mean to f do, well, they probably didn't mean to make such a tremendous fuck-up. They're probably not even aware that they're making a tremendous fuck-up. So I try to give them some leeway on that, but you also need to, I don't know. It's a fucking car, you know, like that thing's a death machine. You should, you should, you should probably, um, I've never made a fuck up to that level that they do that I've seen, you know, um, well, that's not true. One time I did blast through a red light. But it was fine. fine i blasted through red light twice once because again i wasn't i was not in in roads i was familiar with and uh it was night it was raining and i couldn't see shit and then i realized i was in the middle of an intersection thankfully turned out fine then on the return trip from that i blasted through a red light but that wasn't my fault it was snowing and I just slid straight. Through. I did every pump my brakes. I did everything slid right through. And that sucked. And I, you know, I drive a four wheel drive. I know how to drive in snow and ice. And I could, I had no control in that situation. That's the one that, out of those two, out of the, out of the, I had complete control and I fucked up. Or I had no control and was doing everything to try and regain it. The second one is the one that fucks me up the most out of those two. That second one genuinely, like, when I think about it too hard, I, I, like, those feelings come back. I get, like, just scared thinking about it. Because uh, fucking up. You making the mistake 
you can go like you can tell yourself you know uh, that'll never happen again that'll never happen again i i i learned my my i learned my lesson i know how to prevent that here's my plan to prevent that from ever happening again but something that's outside your control like that there's nothing you could it could it could happen tomorrow and what are you gonna do nothing you can't do anything about it you know All right, obviously we need blue Pikmin for that. Can we walk through this, guys? They can't smash that yet. Dude, I hope we, we, we got to unlock moss, right? Playable moss. That'll be dope. Damn, they, they're playing the Pikmin hits here, I think. At least they're they're playing music that sounds like kind of jauntier versions of Pikmin 1. Glad to be living in a place where I can just walk to work. Yeah, that's that's nice. Uh I'm alright. Uh, like I said, I can drive in the ice. I can handle driving in the ice and the snow, um, especially with my work not being too far away from me. I'm fine. But it was this situation where I was in, I was in like upstate New York and it was a totally normal. And then right when we were gonna leave and we had to leave because my friend had to catch a train. Uh, it start, it was just a fucking blizzard. And then you went to stop and just kept every time I'd go to stop, I would just slide. And then, yeah, one time I just kept sliding, slid right through a fucking red light. Thankfully, we were the only car on the road because nobody else had stupid ass obligation. But still miserable. What if you didn't do that next time? Well, um... Again, there were a lot of circumstances that caused that to happen in the first place. So there... Oh! So for that to not happen again, not only would the circumstances have to happen for me to be in that scenario of being in upstate New York, but then the circumstances would have to happen that I wouldn't slide in the snow. So... I don't think that would ever happen again. At least I pray. Seven. Where are the seven stray Pikmin? Oh, right here. Oh, I forgot all about these guys. Is that Moss? Hello? Moss Origins. Look how small Moss is. Maybe they're the same size. In my mind, they're like Ochi size right now. But I guess they're not. Moss. Wow, we playable Moss. you're in a city you're all right but if you're on back roads 
I'll probably not have maintenance done, then you're in the shit. Yeah, 100%. All because the residents of your 4,000 population borough refuses to pay an extra 10% of taxes for road work. There you go. It is what it is. I'm just glad I don't live further away from my job. I I don't think I could ever be someone who would like has like a half an hour, you know, trip to work. Not only because of the time, but also like in the winter. That just means you have such a long strike of perilous journey. You ever see The Hobbit? It's like that. The, uh, it's an unexpected journey. All right, what are we on? It's been, what, three days? Four parts? Three days? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Chat, can you give me one second? I'm going to take another quick pee break. I didn't even finish my coffee. Hold on. Okay. News article about a local municipality raising taxes by 50%. But it turns out it was like $23 for each person. Oh, dude. I mean, that's how it is, man. That's how it is. There, You raise taxes... You say, hey, this money is going to go for the best thing. This money is going to go for providing every kid with a free breakfast. It'll raise your taxes $2. People will, people will fucking go ballistic. $2? $2? Oh, and what's next? You're going to take my home, too? It's $2. Guys, it's $2 and children can eat breakfast. It's like there's... um, What what state is it? Was it Minnesota? That did the free school breakfast? And they're finding out, like, yeah, this is actually going to cost more than we thought. Because so many kids are going hungry... And need these free school breakfasts. And people are shitting their ass. <laughs> Knew it wouldn't work. Yeah, uh, uh, free handouts to children. <laughs> Knew it wouldn't work. <laughs> and who's going to have to pay for it? Me. Buddy. If you can, if you are so bent out of shape. Over an extra 10 15 20 dollars on your taxes so that children starving children can eat I don't know how to get you to care I don't know how to get you to care about your fellow man and especially I don't know how to get you to care about children if you're bent out of shape over 10 15 20 bucks out of your pocket so then hundreds of children can eat? I don't... You're a bad person. I don't know what to tell you. You're a bad person. Thank you. I don't know. Well, those... That uh, $20 could be going to my kids. Well... I don't know. Counterpoint. Fuck them kids. Counter counterpoint. Um No. Thank you. Counter counterpoint. Uh the the large percentile of people in our country, in our society that are falling through the economic cranks. Uh, who are having hard times, are suffering. It, you know, it goes doubly for children. 
Kids can't go fucking get a job. Kids can't go work. They're dependent on us. They're dependent on us as a society to take care of them. And it's getting harder and harder for adults to take care of adults ourselves. Uh, that goes even even stronger, doubly, you know, whatever you whatever uh, uh, verbiage you want to use here, whatever words you want to use here. It's even worse for children. It's our fucking responsibility to take care of these kids. It's our responsibility to take care of our fellow man, dude. And some people can't get that through their fucking head. When we live in a fucking country... Oh, man. We live in a country where we got so many fucking billionaires. We get tax breaks. And yet, how many children are going hungry? How many children desperately needed these free breakfast programs? Like, how do you, how do you, how do you live with yourself? Fighting against giving children food. How do you live with yourself? Oh, uh, well, their, um, their parents should feed them. Their parents can't even feed themselves. How do you look at yourself in the mirror and go, I feel really good about not giving a child $5 so they can eat. I feel really good about that. How? It's our responsibility as human fucking beings to take care of other human beings. That's the responsibility of life, man. I don't know. <sighs> He's saying no to the donation request at the PetSmart checkout. Hey, I always say yes to those things. Am I not supposed to be? When they're like, do you want to donate 10 cents? Yeah, I'll donate 10 cents. Especially because most of the time it's like, do you want to round up 25 cents? Yeah, I'll round up. That, that, my brain feels better when it's rounded up. I'll do that. They already made the donation. They're asking that to recoup the cost. Really? Is that real? Because I always say yes to those things. My point is, if they raised my taxes, if they said, hey, you got to pay an extra $100, $200 on taxes, but this money will go to feeding hungry children, this money will go to this, go to this, go to this, I'd do it. I'd, I'd be all for it. Problem is a lot of times it's a hey, we're raised taxes. Yeah. Where's the money going? Lobbyists. And where's that money going? Uh, funding the police. And where's that money going? Uh, uh, I don't know if we need to get into international issues right now, but going to, um, other countries that to fund, um, let's say bad things. We'll just leave it at that. And, that, and that's where it's like, uh, that's when the taxation thing becomes a, a much deeper issue than, hey, we should just take care of kids. Mike's becoming a political streamer. I'm not becoming a political streamer. Uh, listen, uh, I've thought about this because I know at some point someone's going to come in here. Um, you know, I really respected you for your Super Mario Wonder gameplay, but you've become too political. 
Brother, I was born on this fucking earth political. I'll be buried in the fucking dirt political. I'm not a political streamer. I'm a streamer. And talking politics is part of it. Uh, it's just how it is. I got no interest in sitting around and recapping the news for you. That doesn't do either of us any good. What I am interested in is um, expressing my thoughts and views. That's just part. That's just part of it. Part of the pie. Is there anything up here even? Oh shit, kinda. Whee! Oh, I've already been here. Oh. Get my dog back. Come here. I have enough to build this bridge. No. Okay, I need 10 more. Yeah, I know. Game. Why would the game tell me that? <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, we need bombs. All right, hold on. Fuck this guy. Fuck this guy in particular. Kill his kid too. All right, whatever. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Miss. Oh. Whoopsie. Wait, <laughs> all of our career. <laughs> I thought he spit something out. I didn't know what he spit out. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do, um... How much does moss carry? 10, okay, perfect.
there any goodies over here? Yeah, I need 15 though. Okay. We're honestly, we're kind of flying. We're, we're a sixth of the way done. How long have I been doing this game mode for? Listen, I'm going late tonight, Chant. Uh, I guess I should have told you that. So, uh, you know. Get your little slippies on. Switch it to pajamas. Because we're going late. I can smash shit now. Cool. Uh, fuck it. Move the base over here. Why not? Where? Oh, hello. <laughs> Come here, come here, come here, come here. Run. You idiots. Whatever. We got more on the ship. Who cares? Expendable. I simply do not care about the lives of my Pikmin. They're soldiers. They knew what they signed up for. I missed. Okay, that's water. We need blue Pikmin for that. Can I smash this? Yeah, cool. Um, there's fires that need lit down on the beach. I don't know if this thing's going to hold. Uh, no, there's probably a faster way to go about it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Run. Oh shit. Fuck. <laughs> this is nice. Like I said, it's like um it's like starting a new Pikmin game. You know, like it's just this nice uh it's this nice stage, Pikmin stage, where you're not, you just accept, like, oh, I don't know, I don't have the resources for this. Fuck it, I'll come back later. As opposed to, like, late game Pikmin, where it's like, you better fucking have the resources for this. Okay, what about this? Can, can the, can the pick with the fire cross mud? He's good. He's good. Okay. I was supposed to do this the whole time. Whatever. <laughs> Look at that little waddle. <gasps> there we go. Is there another? I don't know. I don't think there was.
Okay, burn this. I mean, the Pikmin must be blonde. What are you talking about? You crazy? What are you nuts? All right, we got an onion over here. Oh, a yellow one. Okay, that's good. Because there are electric fences. Good, 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 good. We're making good progress, man. What do you mean three Pikmin are going to die? Why are three Pikmin going to die? Where did I lose three Pikmin? Oh, are the, those guys? Is it because they're planted in the ground still? I guess that makes sense. No, I've just lost three Pikmin. What the fuck? No straight. Uh, uh, I don't know about that one, Mac. Methinks you may be fucking stupid. Just a thought. No, no, and three red Pikmin. I'm not shedding any tears. I'm sorry. Home six signal. Oh, that's good. Super buff. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> the moss picture. <laughs> that much. The moss icon is like the fucking stare chat emote. All right, yellow onion. Okay. We're doing good, chat. We're doing good. Good pace. How are we doing so far? Are we on track, chat? Am I doing poggers? Okay, where's that yellow onion? Not there. Fuck, where was that yellow onion? Why did I not tag that on the map? That was dumb. That was stupid of me. Um. Uh oh, now we're just wasting time. Uh oh. Um. Had to have been this way. Gotta be over there. Then you guys collect the corpses from yesterday. Okay. 
And let's see what else is up here. Surprised there isn't one of those fucking flower frogmans. Um, let's see. Egg. Do I have bombs? Because there's a door there that I need to blow up with bombs. I should check that out. four bombs I don't know if that's enough to blow this thing up but we're sure gonna give it a shot I think it'll be enough cool which means we can now do this goodbye All right, next time, let's just try throwing the big one. <laughs> Fuck, I don't have 15. Hold on, maybe I can knock it down. Yeah, but, but Moss is just 10, right? Oh, Moss has got it. Swag. Uh, I think Olimar should say swag more. I think that's my note for Pikmin 5. Olimar should say swag. Right, da 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 da. Let's do this. We need the yellow Pikmin to tear down the electric gates. This I know. There's Moss. Oh, we do, we got, I mean, we got to average two ship parts a day. We're on day four. Okay, so we'll be all right. If we only get this one part today, we'll still be all right. Obviously, we're going to try and make more than just that happen. Please, 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 please. Okay, what is that? It looked like a PlayStation 2 controller that, like, your cousin would have. Did you go over to his place? He's like, yo, check this game out. And it's like Naruto Ultimate Ninja 3, and his controller looks like that. Okay, while the yellow Pikmin handle that, let's go kill the spider fuck. I've missed. I've missed everything. I missed everything. Already lives lost. I've missed.
God help me already Pikmin dying in the streets. Oh my god. Whatever. Oh my god damn it. Chad, did you ever, did you buy, when you were a kid, did you buy a lot of the, like, quarter, 50 cent, like, little figures at the grocery store? The, like, the, you know, the, there were, like, the little ninjas, and there was, like, homies, and... Oh. Oh, yellow Pikmin. For sure. I had a lot of those. Um, I had a lot of, like, little ninja guys, and then I had a lot of, um, there were, like, Nickelodeon ones at one point, and I had, like, like, ten Tommy Pickles. I just had an army of Tommy Pickles that I would make the ninjas fight, which, you know, pretty cool death battle stats, but, like... Maybe not the most uh, natural pairing. Ten babies versus uh, ninjas, but... Chad, who do you think should win? Ten Tommy Pickles or, or uh, ten ninjas? Who wins in a fight? All right, there is an electric thing. <gasps> Blue. All right, we got to get over there. Me. That's not an answer. If I were a ninja, I could slice down 10 babies. Okay, again, not an answer. And this is no baby. I mean, this is Tommy Pickles. This is like king of the babies. This is the best baby there ever was. Well, Baby Yoda, but second best baby there ever was. I, um, I refuse to call Baby Yoda anything but Baby Yoda, and it's starting to, like, piss people off. I have friends who are, like, still really into Star Wars, and I'll just, I'll be like, yeah, fucking Baby Yoda, and they'll be like, it's Grogu. Call him Grogu. Uh, Baby Yoda. <laughs> At least call him the child. Baby Yoda. <laughs> that fucker is going to be Baby Yoda for forever. I don't care. That little son of a bitch is called Baby Yoda. All right, let's move the base up here. How many men? I don't think we get it up that way. Then we get up what? Bridge? Oh, there's another, another thing I got a bomb. Shit. I thought I could just get up that way. I guess it makes sense that you can't. How did we lose three Pikmin again? No, don't disband. Come here. Uh, how do I send the Pikmin home? Hold on, maybe Moss will actually find them this time. Oh. 
All right, well, I want, I'm going to check this out. Because I think this is another bombable. And I've got three bombs, so we should be able to tear it down. Okay, there's another thing to light. I don't know if you had noticed yet, but the days are a bit shorter. Are they? I had not noticed. Oh, okay. We got to burn that down. Oh, this isn't bad. Burn that down. And then we can get the blue Pikmin. Okay. Tomorrow we'll get blue Pikmin. We're making great pace. We're a third of the way done with this. Uh, 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 we got this. How much shorter are the days? The days don't feel like the nights in the summer in the city. In the summer in the city. It's the best part of that song. I used to hear that song all the time when I was a kid. Uh, and like in the middle of it, there's just a synth solo that fucking rules. 20, 25% shorter. Damn. Hey, you know what? But that works out great for me. Alright, third of the way done. Rush boots, okay. More distant areas. Okay, but we're not doing that yet. No, 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 hold on. We're going back there, we're getting blue Pikmin. Okay, I got 10 days left to get 20 parts. Normal is 15 minutes, this is 11, okay. We're going to go back here in just a minute. I got to take that pee break. I never took a pee break. Uh, the whole stream, check the tapes. I never took a pee break. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to take a quick pee break. I actually need to just pee this time. I'll be right back and then we'll uh, keep going. I really think we're going to beat this tonight. I'll be right back. Watch the brothers come. Oh my God. Okay, that got boring. Now let's watch some skate footy. Okay, that got boring. Now let's watch some dog footage. Okay, Mike, you gotta be done. Mike, hurry the hell up. Okay, now we're gonna... Crap. Now we're gonna watch some, here, now I'm gonna play some Zelda. Mike, where the hell are you? I'm panicking here, Mike. Okay, back to the burgers, back to the burgers. Oh, they're burning, they're burning. All right, Mike's done. Enjoy the stream.
Okay. Which Pikmin do you think tastes the best? Gotta be blue, right? Okay. What we need... 30 red. Oh. Fuck it. Do this. Do this so we have room for the blue. Hey. Yellow guys, get... Get your numbers up. Yellow guys, uh, get your bunny up. Sense and uh, yellow guys don't have their shmoney up right now, and it's uh, honestly, it's pathetic. Honestly, I'm ashamed. What is it, is it this way? Wait, which way was the way that I went? Oh, it was just this. Okay. Uh, red guy. Oh, red guy, you fucked us. That's okay. I don't think we'll need your firepower. I feel like blue Pikmin probably taste the best. They would just taste like a blue, like blue raspberry. Well, you know, blue's a flavor. A lot of people want to deny that. A lot of people want to sit out there. They want to say to the world, yeah, blue not a flavor and um you're wrong you know exactly oh my god you know exactly what blue tastes like stop lying to yourself stop lying to the people around you you know what blue tastes like Your disgrace and embarrassment to yourself. Shit. Okay. What, are there any, uh... Oh, right. We'll have the blue so we can get this. And then we've 100% we've in this area. Dude, we're cooking. Not too shabby. Not... Too shabby. Where's that, uh, where'd that blue onion go? Oh. Right there. I think. Wait. Where are you guys going? What are you doing? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Where are they taking that thing? <laughs> Guys, you chose the longest possible way around.
For the love of God. They're gonna take the whole day to get this thing back. Oh, fuck. I might be fucked. We'll see. Those guys might have just wasted the day. No, we're fine. We're gonna be alright. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to blue Pikmin Max as hard as possible. But I think it'll be alright. And then that's it, right? Uh, do I have to get the other types of Pikmin? I sure hope not. The way the way the the way I was led to believe through evidence I cannot provide is that it's only the three types of Pikmin. It's only the original pick three. Um, fuck. Now I'm lost. Shit, that's midday. Fuck. Ah, fuck. Okay, blue. Blue. Blue, show me blue. Show me blue. 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 We need maximum blue. Not maximum, but we need a good bit. Where's the dog? I like, I, I see that with like like moss is a real dog you know like there's there's a real level of like where the fuck is the dog that is a real dog in my brain okay where are we gonna go we need to go right goddamn here and we need to do it now i think we might be fucked i think this might have been a waste of a day okay something tells me i needed five blue Ah, oh, shit, probably. Ah, fuck. Ah, shit. Ah, fuck. Oh! You have to go. You have to carry that as fast as humanly possible. We're fucked. We're so fucked. It's over. It's never been more over. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Bring it here, bring it here. Please, blue. Blue Pikmin, please. I don't know why that made red Pikmin as well, but just give me the blue Pikmin. Okay, seven blue Pikmin. Uh, disband.
Okay. You, you. Okay. All right. This could still be saved. God is my witness. This can still be saved. Here's how I can still win. By panicking. <laughs> Help him. Help him. Go, 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 go. <sighs> okay. I think that's the last ship part here, right? Should be, right? up as many resources as we can but I think we're gonna be fucked I don't think these guys can move them hey, hey, hey Pikmin would stand no chance in the drug trafficking world they just don't move them like they need to God damn it, god damn it. You fucking stop. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Buddy! He did it! I stopped him. I don't think he did it. Why did I stop him? I think he lives. But I don't think that one resource got collected. Is that going to fuck me over? Do you have to be that precise? That the loss of one resource is, is game over? I sure hope not. Okay, nine days left. Um, we could go back. Let's go back. Clean this one up and then, and then we can, um, go to the new ones. Oh, I'm I'm like starting to sweat now. This is getting way too stressful. I wanted to beat Pikmin 4 and then, you know, just have a nice little, you know, just an just a chill, laid back little little joint. This is uh this is fucking management. This is the Pikmin hard mode. Okay. This is what we need. All of these, all of these. Perfect. Okay. Goals for today. Clean up and blue Pikmin. Um, do I have enough to build this bridge? No, because I need to do it from the other side. In this round. Kill this. Shit, stop killing it. Fuck, now it's stuck on yellow. I'm, I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Okay. All right. 
This, this over here, destroy this. Interesting. I need to do something there. But let's start here. Okay, alright. Now... Okay, so that'll unlock that section. What is over here that I needed to get? Oh, okay. Easy. Okay. Let the blue Pikmin carry the corpse. So they get blue points. Okay, go down here. Kill some shit. the resources pretty badly. I can build bridges. Is this what it's like to be a true Dandori master? Is it just constant stress? Like being good at chess, where just every day is a waking nightmare? Uh-oh. Okay, we're just gonna bait him over here. Okay, come here. Oh, you dig that up. Okay. Right, me and these four Pikmin are gonna kick this guy's ass. Are we? We're gonna leave. Bye bye. Oh, I should uh, do that. I should move my shit here. Hello, all of my Pikmin. Let's go kill this man, please. Where is he? Get some more blue. Okay, not like that. Don't do that. We just lost blue Pikmin doing that. I'm sorry, dear Pikmin. Olimar is the kind of guy to, like, write letters home for the Pikmin's family. Letting them know that the Pik died. We're doing good. Feeling good about this. I don't know why yellow Pikmin spawned, but feeling good about this. Right. Why can I not put back the yellow Pikmin? Huh? But I could put back the blue? I don't understand. Oh, maybe because they're not with me? Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Ochi, go find them. Where are all my yellow Pikmin? All 
All right, he'll uh, he'll take care of that. Good for him. Uh, I think I need yellow Pikmin for that. I can't get my guys up there. Shit. Wait. Wait, what if I cheese it? <laughs> no, I don't think that's going to work. Shit. Well, we can build this bridge over here, though. Alright, we're doing good. And, and, and yeah, that's copium, but we're doing good. <laughs> Just let me cope, okay? Ochi. That's not Ochi, that's Moss. I keep doing that. I miss Ochi. Shit, wait, how do I get up here? Oh, I know. Like that, maybe? Or can I Ochi? No. Fuck, how do I get up there? Uh, shit. That's a really good question. Um... Uh, maybe I come around from the top? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. good we're doing good feeling good looking good feeling good we don't need to be over here i do want to see if there's something in here. yes there is oh fuck that's all right these guys aren't hard hold on i know how to do this i remember oh my god i almost didn't though There he is. Right. Does he face me? Okay, bring the base here. Uh, hold on. I need yellow Pikmin. More than any other, I need yellow Pikmin right now. Hey, not bad. Not bad. Gonna kill this guy. Sorry about that. Seemed like a nice guy. Fortunately, he is just sitting in the way. Which means death. Um. Shit, I need those yellow. Okay. 
good. We're not going to make it, but we're so close to just one-shotting a whole day. Alright, we're dead. We're dead. Can Thank you. Just grab. Just grab. Everyone grab shit and run, guys. Okay, good. Extra guys, throw them on. Okay. I don't think we're gonna make it. Oh, thank God. They're just dropping down. We might make it. We might make it. It's going to be so fucking close, though. I can't get in there. Pick these guys. There's a corpse in the way. <laughs> Please, I can't get on the dog either. The dog's going nuts. Oh no. No. Are you fucking kidding me? You couldn't wait one second? We're gonna have to waste a whole day now. Shit. Oh man. Shit. Well, we'll save that for the end. If I've got time left. Right? Is that the smart way to do this? I mean, I got to come back to it either way, right? I have to get all 30 shift parts. Fuck. Ugh. Fuck it, let's go to the new area. I can't believe that. What a... <laughs> Fuck me, man. Literally, their little tootsies, their little Pikmin tootsies, were right at the circle for the ship. Okay. This one, I'm going to assume I'm going to need a lot of blue Pikmin. You know, on account of the whole water thing. Fuck the corpses. We, we've got enough Pikmin. What matters right now is, um, art. Uh, I don't see any parts around here, though. You see this? But 
There's no part over it. Why would I fight this guy? No part. Leaving. Bye bye. No dick. No balls. No part. Okay, now we've got enough. Let's send these guys. Build that while I take the blue Pikmin over here. Other blue Pikmin. Oh, there's a part way out there, it looks like. Okay. Which means there's going to be a big ass fucker in our way that I'm going to need to kill. Right, they got that part. Hello, big ass fucker. Die? Please? He's not dying. He's not dying. Uh, they're drowning. They're drowning. Everyone's drowning. Nobody did any damage because they all decided to drown. All the blue Pikmin just stood there. Uh, guys. The blue, the blue, blue Pikmin, please kill him. Someone do some fucking damage to this guy. For the love of God. <laughs> what are you guys doing? so much time on this that did nothing that did nothing that didn't even I'm stuck in him <sighs> this is really bad Hit him! Jesus Christ. Please! Are Blue Pikmin the single dumbest, stupid fuckers to ever exist? Scientists say, yup. I'm doing like minuscule damage to him, even when I am throwing him on. Jesus Christ. not dead this fucking blows oh god i can't wait for pikmin to be over <laughs>
30. Oh, Jesus Christ. Get up. Get up. This guy's going to kill my Pikmin, isn't he? Just the worst. How did... I feel like the AI got stupider. I don't know, Chad. Okay. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> I just lost all of the. Ah. Oh. <gasps> Okay, I need the 30 blue Pikmin to come with me. We're gonna go over here. Dirty blue Pikmin. They're all going to get killed immediately. They're all getting killed immediately. <laughs> I can't get off him. They're past them. Leave. Goodbye. Hey, crab fucker. Thank you. Hi. Welcome back. Lobster fuck. Cool. Oh, shit. No, come on, game. Thank you, for fuck's sake. Go. No, just go. Ah. At least you guys did your job correctly. Good work. Shouts out to the red and blue Pikmin of our fine nation. We have to replenish yellow Pikmin numbers because I think we are down tremendously. I might be wrong. I don't think I am, but I might be. Fuck the Pikmin, please. No, we're fine. Alright, well that was bad, but maybe good. I don't know how many parts I got. Two? One? Two? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Tear down this wall now. You have six seconds. Tear down this wall now. 
Good. <laughs> I'm running this shit like a drill sergeant now. Any Pikmin left behind? I will call up their parents and tell them that they died a loser. Okay, 16. I feel like we're doing okay. 16 parts. Also, I feel like we're doing terribly. <laughs> I feel like I wasted that entire day, but I, I guess I did get ship parts. It's just in my brain we didn't. Okay, I'm gonna need 20, 20, 20. Let's do fairsies. Splitsies. I don't think we're going to be dealing with a ton of water, but maybe we will be, but. Um, okay, that's a way to do this. Uh, you guys take that. You guys over here. Uh-oh. Okay, that's fine. Come here. Just pop. Everyone pop. Pop your pussy. Thank you. Thank you. All right, everyone all together. Let's murder this man. Goodbye. Everyone, get together. Kill that guy. Thank you. Why couldn't we have that kind of teamwork earlier? I don't know. going to tell Moss to pull that. I suppose we're going to go this way and hope that this crab man doesn't notice us. Or the big crab man doesn't notice us. So far, we're good. Somehow, this is working. Just to make my life easier in the future, kill him. Those guys are going to get eaten. Why are you going? Why would you not take the bridge? Gumby. Stupid. We built a safe bridge for you to take. And you just decided nah. You just decided not for me. Stupid. And that's the kind of thing. I'm going to send letters home to your parents. And I'm going to tell them, hey, your child's stupid. Your child's dumb as shit. I don't know how to break this to you. Your child is fucking stupid. Are there any... 
Oh, I've got the whole sand castle. Oh my god. I forgot about the big ass sand castle. Okay. Um, okay, that's not how I get over there. Do this. Yup. Okay, those guys should be safe for the journey back. What the? Did he just shit himself? What was that? What was that noise? I love all the ball board areas. I feel like they're so fun. Uh, except for the big fat fucking worm that rolls around. I hate that one. That one can go to hell. But all the others are fun. Now I feel like we're making good progress today. I need yellow Pikmin. Fuck. <laughs> Never mind. Ton of resources there, which is good. Hmm. Resources there too, though. I don't, I don't know how to get up. Do I smack him down? No. How the hell? Oh, there's a whole higher level. Okay. Whatever. 
Oh, man. Chan, how's it going? Uh, I think you and I are equal levels of dead right now. Potentially be goodies. We'll figure it out. We'll, we'll worry about that in a minute. Wasn't there another? No, there isn't. Okay. Wait, yeah, where? How the fuck do I get up there? This one. Damn. I should have done all my talking at the start of the stream. Oh. Oh, hello. Oh, goodbye. I think this was a successful day. Um, chat, maybe I finish this next time. Maybe this ain't the end. Uh, cause, uh, chat's dead. I'm tired. Like, I don't, you know, I don't, uh, why am I here, you know? I'm falling asleep, I got, I got no one to talk to, other than myself, and quite frankly, I, I don't think I'm making interesting conversation. Uh, but what is there to say? When you do, like, 75 hours of a game... Uh, that's an estimate <laughs> that I've just thrown out wildly. 70. Where the fuck did I get 75 hours? You've done 50 plus hours. Uh, you know, you kind of run out of things to talk about, about the actual gameplay. And uh, like I said, I, I should have done all my talking about the end of the year at the start of the stream. Uh, I don't know why I didn't. I'm ready for Pikmin to be done. Uh. <sighs> Sorry, I'm not trying to guilt trip people into talking. Sorry. Uh, what I'm trying to say is I'm tired. You're tired. Am I wrong? Is anyone here energized? Is anyone like, yeah! hear this guy just say what he's doing in pikmin yippee like i'm not making interesting conversation <laughs> which doesn't get get you guys talking i know that this is on me but like what the fuck do i have to say about this game at this point the pikmin go over here and they kill the thing wowie great game 50 hours of it is a is maybe a little bit too much to stream. I don't know.
Pikmin 5 smile. I mean, if Pikmin 5 is like Pikmin 4, we gotta wait another decade. I'll play it then. I can I can go a decade a decade. No favorite clips of the year? I would like to do that. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I should have done that at the start of this stream. That's on me. I don't- I don't know why I thought... If I do five hours of Pikmin... I and the chat are gonna have the energy to watch clips you know like that that's on me i i don't uh, i fucked that one up my bad i'm uh still learning you know i still got no fucking idea how to be a good streamer i gotta be honest with you i just wing this shit i don't you know i've done a lot of work to learn more about timing and delivery and Getting funnier and being a more personable person. And I think all those things are important for a stream. At the end of the day, I got no fucking clue how to be a better streamer, man. At the end of the day, I'm just winging this shit. And praying to the good lord that the stream ends up funny. And there went all of my Pikmin and, there, and everyone just fucking died. Now I think my computer's freaking out. Are you guys getting fr like major frame drops? <laughs> I <laughs> literally nothing wants me to be here. <laughs> Fucking car is gonna crash through my apartment. <laughs> and I'm still gonna be like, guys, should I keep streaming? <laughs> I'm going to be fucking under the bumper. <laughs> stuck. I'm stuck in his mouth. How many just got eaten? Ten? That's fine. Uh, okay, more just died. And more just died. Where the fuck is my dog? You just die real quick. Can you just die? Was that all? Take out an army. Hold on. Hold on. Give me only red Pikmin. Because if like 99% of them die, I don't care. I've got 200 red Pikmin. These guys can just be fodder for the war. I don't care.
Wake up. Wake up. Joe Biden. Wake up. Yeah, I'm cooked, chat. I gotta be honest. I'm fucking cooked. I can't. I'm like, my brain is like racing. I'm like, oh, uh, what can I talk about? What's this something I could talk about? I got fucking nothing, man. I'm cooked. Stick a fork in me, I'm done. You know? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I hate the dog. I hate the dog. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. They say war is hell, but is anyone considered Pikmin is worse? stream anymore. <laughs> I'll just stream like Parcheesy from the retirement home. That's good enough for me. Okay. We're missing three... There's still three. So I think there's probably one there. I think there's probably one over there. Maybe one there. Let's go down here and get this onion though. <laughs> <laughs> I need blue Pikmin. I wish I could, like, snap my own neck. I feel like that would be a really good stream ender. <laughs> Oh my god, my arms, man. Alright, is there anything I can't bitch about? I don't think so. I'll find something. I'll f uh, don't worry. If you think there is, I'll find something to bitch about. Don't worry.
What? Oh, I, I guess I did get a part out of that. Never mind. I was going to say, like, why did I do that? There was a part. There's nothing back there. You guys going to get killed by these fish? Yeah, you are. God damn it. I don't care about the bodies. Fuck you. Where are the other treasures? No, not there. Take me here. Go. If you're not feeling it, you can finish it in another stream. That's what's going to happen. Uh, this is the last day. I, I can't do any more of this. The thing is, the next Pikmin 4 stream is not going to be for a bit. There was nothing over here, was there? Oh? Oh? Oh, no. Hold on, I remember this guy. Like I said, though, I, I just wish I, I would have fucking did the end of year wrap up stuff at the start of the stream because I, 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 I don't have it in me. That was my fuck up. Sometimes I forget that I'm 78 years old and so the moment it hits 9 o'clock, I, I like fall asleep. Okay, that's six. We still need two more. There's one there. Oh, and one there. Okay. Fuck, we should move over here. Okay. Where is this? How do I get here? Maybe, maybe from here? Do I need to get all 30? Oh, I do this. I do this. No, I don't. No, I don't do that. Thank you. And how the hell do I get over there? How the fuck? Surely there's a way. Surely. Oh. Oh, maybe the big fucker is here. Maybe it's just this guy. All right, who's ready to watch all of my Pikmin die at once?
Oh, shit. Please, guys, kick his ass a little faster. There's something about the way he falls down that in my mind makes me feel like he's just like an elderly British man being pushed down a flight of stairs. Fucking idiot. Kill Moss. Euthanize Moss now. <laughs> we could have had it. We could have had it. I feel like the AI is way worse in this mode. And I know it isn't. But the amount of like, what the fuck are you doing moments is greatly exceeding. Uh, w what it was in the base game, I feel like. Are the, are the sprouts dead? I don't care. I feel like we're still on pace. I feel like we're still okay. We got five days to do 10 treasures. We can get th this done. And we've got the whole next area though. Fuck. We're going to be, we're going to be cutting it real close. Oh my God. When will the Pikmin nightmare end? Maybe I'll get lucky and get attacked by a rabid dog and go, Oh, it's like Ochi! Is it's fucking gnawing my legs off? Oh, oh, Ochi! I'll just fucking die before I can beat Pick. <laughs> when did I get so depressed? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> At some point, Pikmin did something to my brain where I went from like, gee whiz, I sure love playing Pikmin to I want to be able to snap my own neck and be eaten by a rabid dog. I don't know, man. Listen, chat, do you want me to talk about... Uh... My year. Well, Pikmin beating up your brain. <laughs> it isn't even Pikmin 2. Yeah, dude. That's going to be a nightmare. Chat, you want me to talk about 2023? Because I can, I can do this. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. Uh, okay. Wait, how are we doing this? Movie of the year. Listen, I want to say Barbie. Barbie. I loved Barbie. But, uh... I also want to say Killers of the Flower Moon. As, as a Marty head, as a Scorsese nut, that movie was just genuinely, you know, incredible and felt like, um... It feels like the kind of movie you make when you're 80 and your entire career is spent with people being like, uh, he just glorifies uh, white men committing violence. You make that movie. 
where it is um oh uh yeah america is uh uh built on fucking genocide great movie so i want to say like barbie was, barbie i would say is is the movie of the year whether it's my favorite movie of the year or not I don't know, but Barbie, I feel like, was a piece of this this zeitgeist that we I, I talked about a couple times this year. Of um, this was a year, at least pop culture wise. I feel like this was a very um pink ass girly year, and that rules. I feel like this was a year was a lot about women having a good fucking time. And that rules. That is dope as fuck. Whether it was the Taylor Swift tour, the Eras tour, or the Eras tour movie, or Barbie, or whatever, man. I feel like this was a year a lot about women having a good fucking time. And that rules. So, um, yeah, you know what? I'll say movie of the year, Barbie. I had a great time at Barbie. I gotta watch it again. I gotta watch it again. Um, but that is a funny movie. I did not expect to find that. Every clip that they put out from Barbie, I did not laugh at. I even, there's a clip that they put out for Barbie. I didn't laugh at. And when I saw it in theaters, I laughed at it. Um, that movie is funny. That movie is fun. But that movie has a lot of deeper stuff going on. A lot of deeper stuff that I can't relate to. Because, uh, my guy. But on the flip side of it, there's a lot of stuff in that movie, the Ken stuff, that I could relate to, you know? There's Ken stuff in there, maybe that I don't personally feel like, oh, it's me, it's me. In fact, I'm I'm glad that I don't personally go, oh, oh, me, 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 me. But there's stuff in there where it's just like, oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, I know guys like that. That's true. Uh, whenever Ken, sp light spoilers for Barbie. Whenever Ken thinks that the patriarchy learns about patriarchy and does it by watching like cowboy footage and truck commercials listen i uh I, masculinity is a, is a big thing that i talk about i don't talk about it a ton on stream but um the commercialization of masculinity what a good movie the commercialization of masculinity right is is a big thing it was a big thing to talk about this year, but um, it's dope that a movie about that is the 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 product of about the product of the commercialization of femininity is is taking these these swings about the commercialization of masculinity. It's it's. I, I tried to explain this movie to my dad. Because my dad was like, why are you going to go see Barbie? It's a it's a girl movie. And after I saw it, like, I, I tried to explain to him that, like, it's not just a girl movie. It's a movie about, like, <laughs> like, generational gender stereotypes and, and, and like, all of this shit, like, it's a movie about gender. And that's fucking interesting. For a Barbie movie? For a, for the highest grossing movie of the year? In the middle of, like, this, this, uh, you know, gender identity culture war? Where these fucking shitheads can't just let people identify how they want to identify? Like, what an interesting movie to exist right now. Um, yeah, Barbie movie of the year. Yeah, probably my pick for movie of the year. Though I, I loved Killers of the Flower Moon. 
I keep thinking about that movie and being like, fuck, that was good. I keep thinking about Leonardo DiCaprio in Killers. And, like, I know that we, everyone, you know, kind of hates Leonardo DiCaprio right now. And, and maybe justified, you know. He's kind of, uh, from what we know of his love life, a little bit of a creep. You know. But what a fucking career performance from him. He is so stupid in that movie. But at no point do you feel he's cartoony. And at no point do you feel sympathy for him. Even though you know he's stupid. But you don't feel sympathy for him. Or like, oh, he doesn't know what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. And he continues to do it. A, a great performance. Uh, everyone in that movie is fucking phenomenal. Great movie. So... Yeah, I would I would say uh top three Barbie killers. Dude, Godzilla minus one maybe at number three. That was a great movie. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, that was movie of the year, Barbie. Barbie. Um I, I highly recommend Barbie to everyone. That is, whether if you want a fun movie, Barbie. If you want a smart movie, Barbie. You want a, a comedy, Barbie. You want uh, something that's going to make you fucking tear up, Barbie. Great movie. Um, all right. Game of the year. This is another one where I'm like, my little tootsies are tied. Uh, it's Pizza Tower. Pizza Tower, but Tears of the Kingdom is like... Pizza Tower is here, Tears of the Kingdom is like right here. Uh, I mean, Pizza Tower. How, uh, dude, how lucky are we to live at the time of Pizza Tower? Like, uh, I, I said this when I played it, and I'm going to say it again when I play it again in 2024. We'll talk about that next week, but... um. That is a game that so passionately knows what it wants to be. It's the kind of game where those like super uh, critical people who talk about games, and maybe I'm one of them, but I don't think I'm smart enough to call myself one of them. Um... Those people who really know how to pick apart a game and go, this is why this feels good. Love Pizza Tower. And the, 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 yeah, like it's, there's a reason. That game, what it sets out to do, it does flawlessly. Style wise, it is perfect. Music, perfect. Gameplay, addictive, perfect. It is the closest thing to like a perfect video game in my eyes. Um, is it, is it, you know, is it gonna, do I think it's gonna change the gaming world? I, I, I mean, I hope, but I don't think it will. But it's certainly. It's certainly it meant a lot to me. I really fucking love that game. I really love that game. Tears of the Kingdom then is probably my number two, just right right here. Tears of the Kingdom though. That is a forever game for me. That is um when I was a kid playing video games, I never thought it'd be like this. When I was a kid playing Wind Waker, I never thought, I thought, well, this is the most epic Zelda can get. And I, I don't mean epic like epic puggers, but epic is in fucking epic and scale. And then Breath of the Wild blew my ass off, you know, blew me away. Um, and Tears of the Kingdom is better than that, I would say. So it's uh, one of these things where I, I 
I'm just so impressed with Tears of the Kingdom's innovation. But like, was was it? Well, I haven't beaten it yet. You know, I think if I beat it, maybe it would have been my number one. I haven't beaten it. But we'll be beating it in 2024. Until the next week, here we are. We're going to be beating it in 2024. That's a threat. Anyways. Uh, <laughs> Where the fuck was this energy like 20 minutes ago, man? We, we could still be going with Pigment 4 if I was talking like this half an hour ago. Um, number three for my game of the year was... Sonic Superstars. No, dude, it's probably Resi 4 Remake. That was a fucking video game. And I said this when I played it, of like, I can't wait to play this game 10 years from now. You know, like, I can't wait to keep replaying Resi 4 Remake. What a good-ass game. It, and you know what? It, it It's better than the original. Fuck it. Uh, uh whatever, man. You get that separate ways DLC in there. It's better than the original. Hot take. Maybe. Um, is it going to mean as much to the industry as the original? No. But was it dope? Was it? Is it doper than the original? Yes. Um, okay, that's game of the year. What else do we do? TV show of the year. Man, I don't watch a lot of shows. Seriously, I... I get bored easy. I can I can do about uh, I can do about ten episodes a year. Well, it depends on how I'm watching them. But if I'm watching them by myself, man, I I get bored easy with shows and um. I find a lot of shows. Sorry to the show heads. I find a lot of shows right now to either be comedies that I don't think are funny. Or be dramas that I think are too soap opera-y. Too, they're too dramatic for me to enjoy spending more than two hours in that world, right? But. But. Exception. FX is the bear. Season two came out this year. Fuck, man. That is a great show. The uh, the drama isn't... The drama's believable. The characters are believable. You want to root for them, but they're so... They're so fucking flawed. But in a way where you're just like, man... Yeah. Been there, buddy. Um, genuinely, the bear... I think they're saying, like, season three might be the last if season three is as good as season two they're they're gonna close out like the greatest one of the greatest shows ever i love the bear it's it's funny when it needs to be but goddamn man uh don't watch that show if you have a lot of stress problems uh it will stress you out but for me you know Whoops, I like torturing myself, and I fucking love the bear. Really, really, truly. Um, yeah. Uh, what else is there to talk about? What other categories would you guys want to hear me ramble about? What are, what are we giving awards to? Um... Uh... Album of the year, I can't, like, speak on. I don't listen to enough new music. I gotta be real with you. Uh, <laughs> but I will tell you, uh, Now and Then by the Beatles. <laughs> I know. Just let me have this. Now and Then by the Beatles um, made me fucking cry. So, gonna gonna say that was a good one. And uh, liked that. Is it like a great song? You know, maybe not. But what a crazy thing to be alive for. 
and half the people who played in it weren't alive. You know, like, it's, what a crazy thing. So, um, favorite book, man, I didn't read. I can't read. Sorry. Uh, favorite shirt. Fuck, I got some good shirts this year. Uh, man, gotta give it up. Uh, I don't know, dude. Three-way tie. Can I do that? Favorite shirt this year? Three-way tie between, um... Uh... Uh, I want to get these right. Hold on. Brain Candy... Did a bootleg of the uh, original Star Wars uh, Industrial Light and Magic crew shirt. That was dope. The Star Nars shirt. I haven't worn that in a while. That's a great shirt. Um, who the fuck was it who did... Was it Small Dog? I think Small Dog did... Oh, no, wait. Small Dog, I think, did I, the ILM shirt. Maybe it was Brain Candy that did the Mario movie shirt that I wear. Yeah, it's a fucking dope shirt. Um, fuck, what's the third? I got that bear shirt. That that's dope too. I would say top three shirts right there. Um, favorite. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Favorite streams. Um, I would say the Pikmin Four streams are like the the most consistently good until <laughs> maybe this one. Uh, most consistently good. I've ever been. Let's let's look at some streams, can we? Hold on, let me let me let me crack open the VOD channel here. Um Yeah man, Pikmin 4 was good. Ha the Half-Life streams were good. The Lethal Company streams have been amazing. Um I wanna give it up one first of all, Shotgun Mario 64. That was a funny fucking stream. Um, God damn, that was a good stream. Uh, the Voice of the Void streams were good for the most part. I feel like the last one or two, I've been kind of just like spinning my wheels, but we'll, um, we'll talk about that in 2024. Um, man, Iron Lung, that was a good stream. Uh... Let's see. Yeah, there were there were good streams this year, man. There were some bad ones. I'm going through this and going like, oh. Uh, I will say the worst series of streams was Final Fantasy 16. Uh, dude, Hard Truck Two. That was a good stream. That was a very dope stream. That I'm like this close to being done making into a video and I wanted to do it before the end of the year and couldn't. What the fuck? Doesn't matter. Okay. Um. Yeah. Uh, okay, that's... Oh, wait, was that... Was Interior Worlds this year? Yeah, that was July. Dude, that's a good stream. I I really, really want to do more shit like that. Um, That stream... There, I don't think there was anyone in the chat. But I was so into the vibes of that game that I was just talking about nostalgia 
and not in like a guys remember uh real monsters but in like real tangible way of like that that like feeling you you would get going to like your your like middle school after after it was like closed after the school day um like it would just put like a pit in my stomach to be there after hours and then that turned into a discussion about nostalgia for things like that and how you'll you'll you know I'll I'll never get to experience that again that was if you haven't seen the interior worlds playthrough I did ch check that one out that is a really that's a good um I can't say this <laughs> I can't say like that's a good stream, but I that's the most um that was a really real stream. And I, I wanna do more stuff like that. Um Damn, I've got all the raw danger VODs. Just not uploaded. Like or they're uploaded, but they're not public. I should do that. Raw danger was this year. That was fucking crazy. That's getting turned into a video um, after the Hard Truck 2 video <laughs> eventually comes out. But that was that's where Rontron came from because I just mowed down pedestrians accidentally. And that was a good time. Uh, doing Goose Goose Duck with everyone was fucking great. Uh, nominee for one of the worst streams of the year, the Ninja Turtles Minecraft stream. That was pretty fucking dire. <laughs> um, Summer Games Rodeo. That was pretty fucking dire. The Cabela's Dangerous Hunts 2 stream. Bad stream. Ends so fucking amazing. It starts really strong. Then it gets really boring, and then it ends really, really strong. Um, and that was the start of me doing the VOD channel. Dang. Or no, maybe a little bit before that. Uh, oh, I did that stream where I pretended to get the Asus ROG ally early, and I just had the shitty plug-and-play. Um, I think Final Fantasy 16 was the first thing I started putting up on the VOD channel consistently, right? It, it looks like it. Um, I will say that, man. That's one of the, the, the tangible uh, strengths of this year was getting back into doing the VOD channel. Listen, I, I know no one watches it. Don't get me wrong. I know no one watches it, and that's okay. You guys are here live. I don't expect you to... Double down on VODs. You would be fucking crazy. But um, just the fact that it's there and I've stayed consistent with it. There are a couple series that aren't on there. Like Sonic Superstars isn't on there because I thought those were miserable streams. It, every one of those streams would start with me really getting into it. And then by the end of the stream being like, does this game fucking suck? Huh? Um, so like, I, I still leave some things out if I think they were particularly bad, but, uh, man, I'm just happy I was able to stick with it. And the thing is, is I have every VOD, nearly every stream I've ever streamed is on there. It's just unlisted. Um, so I, I might try like specifically the raw danger stuff. I might try and make sure it's live um the silent hill 2 stuff the stay out of the house streams i feel like those were good enough that i could put up for you guys to watch if you wanted some older stuff but anyways um i really do recommend the the interior worlds stream though but anyways vod channel i'm happy i've stayed consistent with um because that was always a big struggle for me and honestly the thing that helped Seriously, the, the thing that helped was making a thumbnail um, template. That that made that... It's just easy. Just pop, 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 go. 
So um, I've been able to stay consistent with that, and I'm happy about that because I think, um, you know, I think you'll always be able to uh, to catch a funny little guy stream when you want, and that's uh, will people? I don't think so, but like that's okay. I just take some kind of weird, overly sentimental comfort in knowing, like, yeah, at any point, you know, people can pop on a Pikmin stream or a, a, a Zelda stream or something. You know, like, there's there's a part of me that finds that really um, nice, that, that, that I'll just be around. So, anyways, um, another thing I want, I want to talk about, I want to say I've, I've um, been happy with, man. Well, wait, is there any other favorites? You guys want to know any of my other favorites? Favorite JPEG Mafia song. Um, uh, Scaring the Hose, one of them. That one. Favorite meal I ate this year? Pizza at Pizza Brain in Philadelphia. That I I dream of that. Never had pista, p, p, pista, never had pizza that tasted that good. So that was uh, that was incredible, man. That whole um, whole times I went to Philly. You know, I I uh, that first time I went to uh, Philly was. Uh, I don't know, man. Oh. I don't know. That was like the... Um, you did it. Moment of a long, long, cold, lonely winter, man. That was... Uh, we talked about this, but, but last year was the worst year of my life. I'm not gonna... I'm not saying that for hyperbole, but like... To work every single day for six months straight... Working doubles and all this shit. And my dad's, you know, had an accident and was couldn't walk. And I'm trying to take care of him. And um, I'll be honest, streaming became like kind of a fucking burden in a way. Like I was really unhappy with my streams last year towards the end of that year. And, and I, I, I mean, how could I not be? I was like exhausted every stream they weren't funny you know most of the time i was exhausted all the time and so to get through all that and get to um get to may and tears of the kingdom came out and then i was like couldn't play tears of the kingdom because that weekend i was going to philly and i was like uh i seriously was like did i make the right choice should i have played tears of the kingdom I'm I'm so happy I got to do that, man. For a lot of reasons, like I I'll, I I'm not gonna bore you with, but like, it really just felt like the like oh shit, we did it. I made it through that shit. I don't ever want to do it again, but like I I made it through the worst period of my entire life. Well, so far, you know, like, and um. Dude, just going to Philly and just, like, taking in this different environment and enjoying, uh, you know, spending time with my friends that I didn't get to spend any time with outside of New Year's uh, Day, you know, and and um, getting to eat some good food. And then, and then that Sunday, like, he had to do some stuff. He had to work on some stuff. So I just laid around in his living room and watched the best episodes of Star Trek The Next Generation. Like, oh, man, like that. This is going to sound stupid, but like that. The best episodes of Star Trek The Next Generation being on this is going to sound really stupid. But like. You can't plan that, you know. That shit just being on Pluto TV. You can't plan that. And it was just this little thing of like, ah, shit. Shit's kind of good right now, huh? Never thought it'd be this good again. That meant a lot. 
to me and and you know i'm not not trying to be like uh thank you guys but um i don't know man i i got through some tough shit in in ending this year I think happier than I've been in fucking years, man. In years. I'm ending this this year like maybe the happiest I've been in seven years. And it's, it's no fucking small part. Not even, uh, not even a medium part. A large part of this shit, man, is because of you guys. And I'm not trying to be parasocial, and I'm not trying to emotionally bait you in. But goddamn, dude, I've, I've, uh, going from last year where it was like me and Kirby, and sometimes Crunch. And I'm exhausted every stream. And my life fucking sucks. To this year. Where I got all these new people in chat. I got new new regulars. I got new friends running around. You know. And, and we're doing multiplayer shit with, with my IRL friends. And they're... I, I, I... Not to shit on them. But I honestly feel like for the first time. They kind of give a shit about this about what I'm doing I mean I could ask to be in a lot of better places I could ask to be a lot higher on the tree but I'm enjoying the shade I'm down here at the trunk of the tree man and I'm enjoying the shade it it um I'm very thankful for you Chad I'm very fucking thankful I, I don't know how else to put that. Um, to you guys who come here every stream. To you fuckers who give me money. To you guys who, who are just trying to support me. I don't know what the fuck you see in me sometimes. I don't know what the fuck you saw in me tonight. I gotta be honest. This Pikmin stream did not go the way I wanted. But... Man, I'm so goddamn thankful. I I don't get why you're here, but I I hope I can continue to uh, uh, do whatever it is that you want, man. Hey, except for you know, no feet pics. Sorry, that's not happening. Tier three subs only. My point is, if last year was the worst year of my life. Well, I, I could do a hell of a lot worse than this year. I could do a hell of a lot worse than this year. To to go from... I don't even want to go through another year. To, you know, every day I'm excited to stream. And, and every day I'm, I'm getting through the worst of the day. Just to rush home to do this, you know, and... Getting to meet my fucking heroes with Mega64 this summer and getting to see them do a live comedy show that just re, um, I don't know, dude, reawakened my love of doing this shit, doing dumb fucking jokes. I don't know, dude. It's, um,. How lucky am I, man? I don't know. How lucky am I? That's all.
More tears, please. Uh, hey, I'll work on it, man. A crazy thing is I'm not even crying that hard. It just looks on camera like I am. Uh, I'm not crying. Guys, this is a smudge on your screen. Uh, wipe it. Yeah, the thumbnail, <laughs> thumbnail, <laughs> thumbnail is gonna be um, gonna be uh, uh OG. Thumbnail is gonna be when they find out that Moss can't come with them, and then I'm gonna just put me over it, turn my opacity down, and me just crying over it. <laughs> top ten, Pikmin, top ten saddest moments. <laughs> Anyways, I just want to say thanks. Thanks to you guys who, who show up for every stream. And thanks to you guys who, for some fucking reason, give me money. Um, You know, thanks to you guys who don't give me money. Again, there's so many free ways to, to support my shit. And you guys always seem to take advantage of that in the good way. You know, you guys... You're clipping, you're, you know, like, the clips are so helpful, and, I don't know. Thank you. Sorry I didn't beat Pikmin 4 tonight. This would be a lot cooler if I did, but. I got a lot of big stuff planned for 2024. I got a lot of, well, I don't want to say big, because I don't want to overhype it. I got a lot of weird ideas. Whether it's um, being able to draw on top of my stream, or um, there's there's some other stuff I don't I don't want to even kind of talk about because it's so like well, <laughs> we gotta hope that this one thing works. I gotta I gotta soft pitch something. Um. Or, you know, GTA RP streams are going to happen next year. And on on a on a server that I, I really think is good. And I'm I'm really excited to just fuck around with that and do some bits with that. And I'm hoping that listen uh, uh, next year. I think funny little guy is only going to get better. I'm hoping the rest of my life can at least stay where it's at. Stay stable. So that funny little guy can keep going the way it is. But I got a lot of, I got a lot of things and I'm not just talking about cool games. We got a lot of, uh, now that we're uh, coming to the end of five months of Pikmin four. Um, you know, that it makes more room on the schedule for some cool shit. Um, Metal Gear Solid is definitely happening once we finish the Half-Lifes. I've kind of figured out, like, okay, what is the successor to each, each like, game that I've, that I've been playing in this, this kind of last couple months? What's the successor? And I've, I've, I'm saying, I'm telling you Metal Gear Solid because I already talked about this. Once we do the Half-Life expansions and Half-Life 2, then we're doing Metal Gear Solid 1, 2, 3, 4. And I will play Metal Gear Solid 5 for the first time. So that's happening. Um... Everything else, though, is sort of up in the air. I know I've I've got the lines drawn. I've got the lines figured out. But I also have to balance shit like Tekken 8's coming out in January. And, uh, man. I don't know if we're going to do a ton of Tekken 8. But you're going to get some fucking Kuma-ass gameplay. You don't put those words together like that, but... Um, other things I want to do in 2024 relating to funny little guy, I got to get more videos out. I've been, um, way too perfectionist about videos on the main channel. I've had this hard truck two video. I've been working on this thing since like the day after the stream in August. 
and it it's not doing me any good because the more i watch it the less funny it is naturally that's how it works and i'm holding this thing back because i'm not i'm like ah this ain't funny yeah because you've seen it 600 times man so i, I want to try my goal i wrote this down my goal if i can do i shouldn't be telling you this on stream if I can do one video every two months next year, if I can put out six videos next year, I'll be more than happy. Whether it happens or not, I don't know. Um, let me, what am I, hold, I wrote down my goals. I thought I was bleeding there, I scared myself. Six videos. I'm not telling you the second thing on this list because it is it is stream related, but it's a secret. Um, man, I want to do a voice reel. Uh, I feel like it. One, I've always wanted to do voice stuff. That's kind of my strength. Is doing funny voices. Um, I want to put together a voice reel and I think it would be fun to do some of that live and have you guys suggest voices and suggest lines. I feel like that would be a really fun idea. I want to go to Philadelphia again and nothing you can really do about that unless you give me all of your money. This is a stick up. <laughs> um, dude, I want to get my... <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna maybe sound stupid. You're gonna think like this is this guy one of this guy's New Year's resolutions. Man, I wanna get all of my goddamn relic weapons in Final Fantasy 14. I have been I've been playing that game for almost three years now. Dawn Trail comes out this summer, the new expansion. I wanna get all of my relic weapon shit done before then, and I think I can do it. As far as I understand, it just gets easier from where I'm at. Um, and then the other stuff isn't really related to stream, but one of the things I do want to do is get back to ripping VHS tapes. That is something I loved and I did none of it this year. I don't think, uh, no, I ripped a Star Trek tape and that was it. I ripped one tape this year and that's a shame. That's a big fucking shame because I love ripping tapes. And now that I've found like a community of people who aren't just sharing the commercials, but sharing the whole thing. Um, I want to go back and re-rip my earlier tapes and then uh, rip these new ones and contribute to, I gotta be honest, a fucking community that I have uh, pilfered. Man, I have so much, I got like seven terabytes of tape rips of old, you know, live television broadcasts of, you know, six hours of Adult Swim from 2007, shit like that. And I watch it on my CRT and I'm so happy. It's so nice sometimes to just turn my brain off and watch that. Um, and I have downloaded so much and I have given nothing back. So I want to I wanna fix that in 2024. Um, other New Year's resolutions. Well, let's talk about this, actually. Um, my New Year's resolutions for 2023 were... Um, <laughs> survive. <laughs> Still be streaming, you know, still be doing funny little guy. Um, but I really wanted to, um, I had some numbers and I'm not going to say like, Wowie! but I will tell you my goal <laughs> Was to go up a very, you know, 10. Yeah, can I get 10 more followers on Twitch? I did that. Yeah, can I get 10 more subscribers on YouTube? Holy shit, I think I got like 80 subscribers on YouTube. Um, And then my goal, my main goal was to get average viewers to go up on Twitch. Because that's the, that's the number that matters to me. Is people coming back to the stream. And, uh... I just wanted one. <laughs> I wanted my average viewers to go from like 2.5 to 3.5. And when I checked it earlier today, it was almost at five. 
That's pretty good. I will take that. Uh, it's, that's pretty fucking good. That's way better than my expectations. Um, but, you know, numbers don't really mean shit to me. Um, as long as I'm having a good time and doing shit that interests me, I don't really care about the numbers. Obviously, I want to see them go up, but I don't really care at the end of the day. Um, but the fact that they did go up, really up in some places, is wild to me. Wild to me. So thank you again. All right. With that being said, any um, we're gonna, we're gonna check out some clips here in a minute. I'm gonna go through and show you some some clips I like. Anything else in, in New Year's resolutions? Anything else about? Do you have any questions about shit in 2024 for funny little guy? Is there any um? Or just this one uh, uh, out the gate? No. You're welcome. <laughs> Will we see a full playthrough of Pugsy in 2024? You'll have to tune in and find out. How many toes did I did I suck in 2023? You know what? None. And I'm I'm pissed off about that. Sad day. I didn't even suck my own. Got two ribs removed, can't even suck my own toes. Sad day. Alright. Let's check out some clips real quick. Well, Actually, yeah. We're going to just check out... We're going to check out some. So some quotes Kirby hasn't added yet. Kirby! We're going to have to dock your mod peg. Let's check out some clips. So this was from... Uh, this was from Raw Danger. These were some good streams. Vods aren't up though. Um, I should uh, I should get those vods live for you guys, but uh, maybe I will. Maybe I will. It it would not be too hard. They're already uploaded. I just gotta make thumbnails. Um, I I have no context for these clips, by the way. Uh. Let's, uh, this one's just titled Same Streamer Same. <gasps> I'm very wet. Okay. <laughs> How many of these clips are just going to be me taken out of context? You're out of smegma? The smegma machine's broken. <laughs> what the fuck are we talking about? Why is it every time I come here, the smegma machine is broken? <laughs> okay. <laughs> good clip. Good clip. Uh, this was a good one. I don't remember why, but Crunch said that I should uh, make my stream look like it was on a best a TV at like Best Buy. Buy takeover weekend. <laughs> so it became the Best Buy so Takeover Weekend. Just, uh, I mean, Best Buy, Circuit City, Radio Shack, uh, <laughs> Fry's, Electronics, whatever you can get me on uh, at the Apple Store, uh, Verizon, you know, whatever. Uh, we're going to be kind of trying to just like reach out. This is kind of like a community global outreach program to get me more viewers. So let's keep that up. Yeah, that was good. Uh, what the fuck is going on in this? What is this? I don't know what that is. That's not me. I'm going to put myself up here because I don't think I ever put my webcam up here. Um. <laughs> oh, oh, jolly good ladies. Keep singing about your pussies. <laughs> okay, I didn't say that. Marvelous hilarity. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. 
Um, what's this one? If I knew there was even a chance of a return of Woodsy Owl, I would kill Dozer. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now, all right, now we're going too far. <laughs> now I'm getting put on an FBI watch list. We got to reel it back. Okay. This one just says no context. Oh, the, you know what? This is a highlight video on the on the main YouTube channel. If you want to see this, go to the uh, exclamation mark YouTube. Go to the YouTube channel. Um, I talked about the retirement of Smokey Bear, and um, it turned out pretty good. Okay, so my favorite thing during the Dead Space playthrough was um, every time there was like a scare or someone would get murdered, I'd go, uh, are they okay? Uh, and then, like, yeah, shit like this would happen. If this is the clip, I think it is. It might not be. Why did that not work? What did that hit? He's behind me, isn't he? Uh, gulp? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that, dude, the Dead Space streams were pretty good. Streamer is dead. Oh, dude, I forgot all about this. I keep forgetting that, that this was even this year. Um, We did a charity stream this year. Didn't we, ra we raise like $420.69 or something like that? <laughs> this is such a good clip out of context. <laughs> Hold on. Play that again. That's such a good clip. <laughs> it's the, the the Mario Party music is what makes it, dude. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. That's a good clip. So that was, uh, did I do a front flip? Uh, that was, that was my favorite, uh, my famous, uh, flip incident. Um, oh man, the Kugane jump stream. I, f I forgot chance. this happened this year. Please. So if you don't know in Final Fantasy 14, there's a whole ass tower. You got to climb. Uh, and then, uh, you do a big jump. I it's a whole jumping wait, wait, wait. puzzle. I'm all screwed up. I'm all screwed up. Camera. And it was a fucking nightmare. It took all stream. See the fucking umbrella. I think this is right. I didn't jump. I got scared. All right, this is the one. This is the one. Oh! I missed. I missed. I did it! We did it! Yeah, that was... That was... I jump was done! Nightmare of a stream, but good payoff. Um, I did one Elden Ring stream, I think, this year. Uh, hey, at least we got a smithing stone. And it was actually pretty good. How? Well, oh, yeah, because I had turned off alerts. Oops. How the hell... I thought I had turned off alerts, and I didn't understand how you guys Shut were still doing honk up. of your horning. That was a good time. Uh, this was my favorite clip from that Elden Ring stream, though. I, t I put this on social media. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, watch this. Watch this. It's that easy. <laughs> what the hell? That was a good time, dude. We'll uh, we'll talk more about that next year. Uh, water gone wide. See now, I don't know you what the fuck this was. TV. It's not starting good for you. I'm telling you right now. Oh right. So okay. So this Crunch wanted me to watch this video about this water guy. Video about what water to buy at Whole Foods. 
Fuck it. Oh no, it stretched the <laughs> I forgot to turn the, the stretcher off. So I have a Chrome extension to stretch content. <laughs> extension. Yeah, for my CRT, it's a whole thing. But holy shit, dude. <laughs> He was just wide the whole time. I think we watched the whole 10 minute video. Um, what's this one? It's getting what? Okay. All right, we're good. Oh, dude. This one I feel like needs some context. Um, I hurt myself, man. This year I uh fucked up my ankle at one point and it was really bad. Um, and so I was like, "Well, I want to stream and so I did a stream from my recliner. stiff <laughs> again. Okay, it's me talking about my ankle. Okay. Uh, okay, a lot of Dead Space clips. I, I guess the Dead Space uh, streams were like better than I remember them being. I think I just came. <laughs> what was that? What was that clip? <laughs> The quality of my content has gotten so bad that the only way to get funny moments is to take me both out of context and trim the shit I say. <laughs> We've really hit that low point, huh? Okay. Can you guys stop coming? <laughs> How did you get me twice with that? <laughs> oh... <laughs> Okay. Big ups to the miners. Make sure that beacon's not wired to anything. Is that what the, is this funny to you? To take an innocent man like me out of context like this. Like always cool. Is that is This is fucked up. This is fucked up. I had a really good time today. I had a really fun time. I'll see you later. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> I look fucking disgusting in that clip. <laughs> I I look fucking bad in that clip. I feel like I look so much better now. You gonna do something? Don't do that! <laughs> oh, this is a classic. This is a classic. <laughs> no way! <laughs> Dude! Fuck no 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 no! Shut the hell up. That was a terrible stream, but it w was worth it for that moment. Whoa! Is he giving me the side eye? Do you see that? He's like smirking at me. All right. Getting bullied. Oh, uh, this is... You know what? I thought this clip was going to be big on social media, and it was not. Oh, just die. Dude, just die. Oh, you son of a bitch. You took too long to die. Cow! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> No, stop! <laughs> Just stop! I'm getting bullied! <laughs> I love that clip. That clip did, like, negative numbers on social media. What's this one? Oh, I know. Never mind.
Uh, excited to do a Lipa raids. What is this? I'm excited to like do the uh, do alliance raids. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Digzing. Who is... Oh! Dude, the Pokemon... Um, fusion ever... stuff. I forgot all about this. What did you guys do? Why did you do Yeah, my, my Pokemon just kept dying. Uh, the Judge Dread stream? Or streams. I think there was like two of them. The first one was great. The second one was just kind of like, yeah, not as good. Okay. Arrest that robot. <laughs> no, <laughs> come on. <laughs> I feel like I could turn that into a really funny video. I should do that. Those are good. Man, the AI flug stuff was this year. I, f I thought that was last year, and man. For the record, dude, I'm not wanted for murder in Chicago or any <laughs> other city. I'm just a chill skater dude trying to spread good vibes and sick moves wherever I go. <laughs> That's exactly what someone who's wanted for murder in Chicago would say. As Flug, dude, you got me. I admit it, I'm actually a secret mastermind criminal and I've been on the run for years. <laughs> the truth comes out. The truth comes out. This was a really, like, fun stream at the start. If I remember correctly, by the end of it, it was like, what do I, okay, what do I even ask him? Flug, do, you, do your feet smell? No, dude, my and feet flood. don't smell. Oh, dude, okay. that sounds like quite the situation. I'm not sure what to tell you about the bird butthole or the cat buttholes, but for the poop on your shirt, I'd recommend finding a bathroom or sink and cleaning it off ASAP. Maybe also wash your hands and any other parts that came in contact with the bird poop. And as for the accusation of murder, uh, let's just forget about that and keep things light and fun, all right. Like, it, like, started, it, it, the stream became less about, um, what can we make the AI say, and more about, um, how, what if we just say fucked up things to the AI, and the AI goes, that's not cool, and that was that, but it started really funny. Uh, maybe it's this? <laughs> that's hey, you know what that's uh that's, that works that's real that's uh <laughs> god thok was this year is come warm i don't want to play this clip It's just me baiting. Yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> yes, yes, it is. Yes, it is. I had to think about that one. But it's like piss, you know, piss, hot piss. <laughs> uh, do the Freedom Rider. Uh, let's see, man. God, we're worst. We're, we're so far away. This should have been a whole stream in on itself. What's this one? Can I? Wait, 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 wait. Let's do this. Views. Created. Oh, I can only do last 30. I can't do a year. Fuck. Never mind. Well, now I just fucked this up. Sorry. No, don't. Okay, do the. Click the. Hello? Google? I, 
think Chrome's pissed off. All right, chat. Um, let's see. Listen, a lot of the really great ones at this point ended up on social media. What was this one? Hey, Lil B. Heard it was your birthday. Happy you made it another year. I'm a big fan, and uh, I hope that you have a good birthday. I hope you have a lot of cake. I hope you have a lot of balloons. I hope you get a lot of presents. Um, I hope you have a good time, and I want to say thank you for being the base god, and I want to say thank you for being just so cool and being you. So did this, did this ever get sent uh, to uh, Little B? <laughs> happy birthday, based God Little B. Thank you. Did he? Uh, did he ever see that? Oh man, that first bomb rush stream where I got obsessed with the basketball. That, that stream was, like, extra long, too. Because I would not stop doing this shit. <laughs> and then it didn't work, right? Why? This is called Twerk and Pappy? Twerk. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Yeah, um, my grandpappy was one of the best twerkers um, in Pennsylvania. <laughs> Mm -hmm. When he threw that ass back, I mean, he made that pussy pop. I think this is when I realized that I enjoy saying pussy pop. So that's good. Oh, man, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre stream. Isn't there a movie where Jason fights Leatherface? Uh, no. There's Freddy versus Jason. Uh, you know, that's, but that's Freddy. Oh... I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm going to leave <laughs> or I'll stay. Uh, he's coming back. Come on, man. <laughs> what am I doing? How's this game doing? People still play this or? They add anything to it? Any, any new characters or streamer versus door? Mm hmm. Starfield, those are bad. Uh, you know, so, um, the other week my wife said to me, she said, uh, hey, I'm going to the store, gonna go pick up a little, um, you know, a little, uh, dinner. And I said, well, <laughs> Hopefully you don't uh, pick up another husband on the way home, you know, or <laughs> do. <laughs> Anyways, um, <laughs> we're in an open relationship. Uh, you know, I always thought, uh... I always thought polygamy was when I jerked off to Princess Peach and Mario Party. What? Huh? What is that punchline? <laughs> uh, uh. I don't know what that punchline is. I, I have to be honest. I have no idea what my... Because, like, polygons? 
Get this fucking streamer out of here. This guy sucks. <laughs> Colonel, it's time to get funky. Hey, that was a good clip. Um, all right, this is just three question marks. Those are always the best clips. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This clip has just come. <laughs> this is the pizza strip. As for the cum taste. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. 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 The cum is good. The cum is good tonight, everybody. <laughs> Whoever made the cum tonight is Michelin star cum. Oh, <laughs> uh, this kind of rules, man. You know, if I watch these like the day after I did them, they're not funny. But if I watch them, you know, three months later, no memory of doing them, they are way funnier, man. <laughs> mm-hmm. And then five more after that. Oh, shit. Ah, ah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, I gotta, that, that, that last clip is so fucking funny to me, that's so much funnier than even the, the last one that was like that, like the way that I just, <laughs> the, it's the timing on it of, oh shit, <laughs> and then there's a beat, the beat is so instrumental to that being funny, oh fuck, that one's good. All right, chat. Fuck the night expedition. We are not doing that tonight. I got to get out of here. I got so much shit to do. I got so much ass to eat. That's <laughs> not what I'm... <laughs> uh, this is the this is the Voices of the Void Llama Santana. clip. Uh-huh. L L A M A dot S A A T A N A. Did I do it right? Did I... Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, stroke. Don't bad me. I wore a bad bitch hat on. <laughs> I don't think that's less stroke and more. Um, I can't read. <laughs> I'm not here to tell you that. I'm here to tell you. This is a pro-alien stream. A lot of people play this game. They're anti-alien. They're scared of aliens. I'm not scared of aliens. I want to fuck an alien. I want to fuck a big, beautiful blue <laughs> alien. <laughs> and I stand by it. And I'm proud of it. And I would do it too.
shit's gonna explode. Oh, this. It's so many keys. Oh! <laughs> Good put. Uh, you've seen this one a hundred times, so I'm not showing you that one. Why there's a blazing blaze you running into someone, huh? Jesus. Nice to meet you. Jesus. This is our first time meeting, right? Or maybe you already know who I am. I heard there was treasure somewhere around this place. And next thing I knew, here I was. <laughs> Do you think anyone lives on those aisles over there? And what's with all the smoke? Also, I found 50 flower coins. They're all yours. Should be helpful out in the world. See you around. That's worst voice of the year. You just took years off my life with that chat. Are you proud of yourself? Uh, this is maybe the most watched clip of the year. It's just titled Humble, or Attempt at Being Humble. The gates. As oh, this is when I was doing the 12th level intellect bit. And be able to take books from the library of knowledge and open them and show them to you. You are about to see Dan Dory strategies. Yo, who wants their dick sucks? I'll get the grapefruit out. <laughs> I had to let myself finish. Um, let's see. Celibate streamer. And that's it. I don't. I don't fuck with beer. I especially don't fuck with pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Stop taking me out of context like this. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Chad, do I actually... God, this game was cool. Okay, so if I cross that threshold at all, I lose. <laughs> okay, didn't know that. Oh, don't start me with losing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that game. That game was very cool. Um, this one is just uh, I don't even know how to read this. Oh, I know how to read it. It's um. Uh, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> got it. Um, let's see. Oh, this is when I did the BLJ. Hey, one of the best moments of the year. When I finally did a BLJ for the first time. Oh my God. <laughs> Never done it before. Live, first time. That was a good stream. Shotgun Mario was a good stream, man. Um, let's check out this one. Blackmail material. That point. Hold on. You're reading this uh, redeemed piece of Flug lore. Does Flug support the death penalty for David Zaslow? In fact, he wishes he could be the one to pull the switch. Try him. <laughs> All right, chat. We're almost done. No context again. What? This was like a month ago. What did I say a month ago? Oh, maybe it's not what I said, but what I did. <laughs> Okay, good clip. 
Oh man, the Lethal Company stuff. I feel like this is so fresh. Uh <laughs> 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 He's done. He's cooked. <laughs> 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 Step on the landmine! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta hit left. You gotta go uh, in just inside of the Oh God! Line. Shit, that ruled. <laughs> I, I mean, uh, yeah, this is from a month ago. I mean, 18 days ago. But like, you know, it, it's so like I feel like that happened this week. Oh, this is a, this is a classic. Right, I'm gonna jump over this. Watch this. <laughs> hey, I gotta, I gotta give it to Lucas on the, on the clipping of that one. Perfectly timed ending. <laughs> All right. Uh, eight days ago. This is the last clip. Wake up time. Is this okay? This isn't the guy with the machine gun though. So we're okay there. That's nice. That is the guy with the machine gun. Oh, I destroyed all the cover. <laughs> Run that back. Run that World's back. World's smartest Pikmin 4 player. That was a good clip. All right, chat. Um... No, you know what? I got one more. This this clip made me... I didn't even... <laughs> I, I don't even remember this. This clip's great. Howdy, um, uh, and, uh, uh, ho, more like, ho, ho, uh, ho, ho, hody, hody, hody. Uh, that's what Santa, Santa... <laughs> Again, it's just the timing on it makes it funny. The beat is so good. Uh, here, you know what? Last one. This is from literally yesterday. Can't get more... Well, I guess clip from this stream, but... Good clip. Chat, that's it. I don't have any more in me. I don't have any more clips in me. I don't have any more bits in me. I don't have any more shits in me. I'm out of here. That's the last stream of the year. Once again, did not finish Pikmin 4. I feel like it's a running theme for these streams. Didn't finish Pikmin 4. But, uh, had some laughs. That's it for me for 2023. This is a funny little guy in 2023. Good year. Good year for me. Yeah. Good year for this channel. I'm going to get out of here. I'll be back. Um, I'm not streaming New Year's Day, but I will stream, what, the second? I'll be live. Um, either with Lethal Company or with Zelda 2 Blind Race with Pelamoon. It's one or the other. We're still figuring out the schedule on that, but we're going to get that fixed. We're going to get that figured out quick. And then... Uh, that, and then the day after that is whatever I don't do on Tuesday. And then, uh, I got some other stuff. Well, uh, you'll have to wait and see. Hey, have a happy new year. I hope, uh, I hope if you gotta work, that it isn't too busy. I hope you can take the time to, uh, reflect on the fact you made it another year, you know? Was it a good year? Probably not. Probably not a good year for you. But you made it. You made it through another 365. And that's a fucking accomplishment, man. Let's be honest. All the fucking, you know, people who are uh, dying from getting, putting their heads in penis suction machines and, you know, they get their, their head ripped off. Is that, um, do people really die like that? Or is that, am I exposing a fantasy? We'll find out.
<laughs> I don't know how we'll find out, but we'll we'll get the science team cracking on that, and we'll figure that out. Chat, that was uh, that was me for 2023. I will. Uh, I'll see you next year. Hey, I haven't. I haven't. Uh, I haven't had. A, I haven't showered since last year. Fuck. Is that what that smell is? Shit. I mean, like, like literally. <laughs>